try to get some other people in here. Let's see, did that just get my mic live or am I still having mic issues? Let's see, audio, test, test, test. There we go. All right, we got our mic running now. Sorry, I had y'all uh, no mic going. Um, we are going to have some fun tonight. We are going to play a little around a little bit. Um, we can literally show your comments live. And now that we are officially a paid member of StreamYard, we have the ability to do some other fun things. We're going to play with the lighting just a little bit. Who oh, no. I'm turn that down a little bit. up one there we go now look at that look at what a change that makes compared to that crappy little light we had um we are live and having fun i don't know why joe is not in here yet and it doesn't look like we've got anybody else in here but we are going to text that idiot and tell him to come on in and hang out with us Oh, uh, let's see. What is going on, y'all? Miss Lisa Noble, uh, if I'm not mistaken, you were the winner of the Luau sponsored mystery box we did. And I got an email from you what, yesterday telling me how much you love that mystery box. And uh, very soon you're going to be getting one of your own done up um, with a much higher value on it. And it always makes me happy to hear that I have created a trust, a customer that trusts me enough to make them a higher value mystery box. That's always a good thing. What's up, LBD? We are officially on StreamYard now, not just pretending, not just playing, but we are officially here. Um, we're waiting on uh, Joe for Joe Mama to come in. Uh, we might send him that live link one last time. Yeah. So we are having some fun playing around. I got to get my logo up in that top corner. Uh, Jarhead, rotate your uh, camera sideways, bro, to get a full screen. Yeah, there we go. Now we're going to add you to the stream. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that sexy mug right there. Uh, did not kill himself after the night we had last night. <laughs> uh, it was painful, but not bad. Dude, you kept going, though. No. We gave you outs, and you would not take them. I don't do that. I don't take the easy road. Well, that's kind of dumb sometimes. I mean, we love you and all. But sometimes we feel we need to pray for you. <laughs> I mean, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm just to the glasses, man. It, I went down to the store real quick and it rained and yeah. But um, I am setting things up as we get rolling live. Um, we're playing with the settings now that we have access to things like brand controls. It no longer says StreamYard up there, as you. Oh, can look see. at that! Get the logo. Nice. Yeah, I need to get just a. Uh, I need to cut the logo so I can get rid of the white background around it. Yeah, that's what I was doing before I decided to run down to the store. What is this overlay uh, show? Oh, I need to create me a lo an overlay. That would be cool. I can change the background. Oh, I wonder what I have in the background. Look cool. As a background. How about that shot for my drone? Oh, that look. We've got new toys to play with, folks. Oh, crap. Look at that. <laughs> How about that? That's kind of weird. Almost forgot before I popped the top that I'm supposed to slightly shake this. Is that your fire beer again? Chalada. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. 
trying to see what I have that I could throw up as a good background image. I'm going to need a background image. Y'all are going to have to. Uh... <laughs> why, don't, why don't you throw up that picture of your case? It's in the background. Of my case? Yeah, with your hot toys in it. Because it's not the right, it's not the right width. But, oh, uh, it's not going to show the full picture. Damn. That's the one that says anal doesn't seem like such a bad idea right now, does it? Not the right width. Oh, wait, but, I got to mute that. Oh, it's not going to show the full picture, Dan. What's the one that says anal doesn't seem... <laughs> there we go. <laughs> yeah, I went pro. Hey, so um, LBD asked how bad was the shits. I will tell you that Joe texted me earlier, and let me read you this text message. You ever, like, cook chili, and you let the chili sit, and it gets that film over the top? It literally says, I just farted and pooped a little bit. <laughs> hey, am I too whited out? Like, do I need to change this up a little bit? Nah, I can't tell because I got the light in my eyes. So. Yeah, I can go down a little bit, but then it darkens my background too much. I wonder. I can make myself orange. That's too much. I think that looks good right there. There, how's that look? Does mine look all right? You look a little less gay in that picture. Well, the ring light was like in my face and the glare on my glasses, so. Oh, that's right. Did you send Travis the link? I sent him the link. Ian Wrestling King's in here. Yeah, what's going on, guys? So, I have to show off. Um, oh, Pop King Paul just posted a photo. Hold on. Holy fuck. Uh -oh. Update. Sorry, guys. I didn't forget about you. Because you, you're still worried about that two-pack, aren't you? Yes. Oh, fuck. Sold out? They're $475 boxes. Fuck that. Yeah, he doesn't do cheap stuff no more. Uh, he does them every once in a while. But not fucking good boxes. Dude, I found a Hot Wheels card today. I should have brought it out here. It's fucking badass. It's the Batmobile. And it's like freaking five times the size of a regular Hot Wheels car. And it was on clearance at Walmart for two fucking dollars. <laughs> so I do have to show y'all. Me and Joe kind of went FaceTiming it on uh, Instagram today to pick out the new goodness for y'all. And for the first time in my life, I paid some real money for some good scotch. Because I didn't want the 10-year, not the 12-year. We went for the freaking 15-year. Lisa Noble said dark looks better. She didn't want to see your ugly-ass face. <laughs> Look at this, guys. Oh. 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 I've never had a 15-year scotch before. So I decided if we're going to be drinking, I uh, I went and got a soda so that I can make myself a mixed drink. I don't drink sodas anymore, so that kind of well, my mixed drinks for me. Uh, Y'all, I will tell you, we spent all day. My shop is fucking clean right now. I wonder if I angle this. Oh, couple, that help a little you remember bit. that uh, Highland Park 12 that I was telling you about when you were in the liquor store earlier? Yeah. With, yeah, me, with my nine-year-old? Yeah, that's that's this one. The one I was touching on last night mm, that jack daniels single barrel i know the logo is backwards i wonder if i do it this way it will work yeah uh. oh i can go get some good rum <laughs> oh no 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 but no, no. if we're gonna be doing like shots and i'm gonna be mixing drinks and stuff i just cracking dude you're not like tipsy bartender all of a sudden um, I'm not a big rum drinker anymore. If I ever do drink rum, Appleton Estates is more than enough for me. See, and I, I can't find that. I got it here. Is it, or is it Appleton Estates that does the plantation rum? That, that sip on it, sip on it, sip on it, sip on it. <laughs> we got a little bit. How was the shits, LBD? Oh, wait. We've done that a while ago. <laughs> Hi. 
Um, I didn't. I didn't have this shit. <coughs> he just farted and shit came out. Like I said, it, it it was a little bit of blockage, and then it went away. Little bit of blockage, my ass. <laughs> yeah, a little bit of blockage in my ass, and then it went away. <laughs> Dude, I drink. I drink so much hot sauce. Tomorrow, I actually have to go to the store and buy more. That's bad. And my buddy asked me, he goes, so I was talking to my buddy on, on uh, Xbox last night. And he goes, so what are you doing? Are you like filling it up with like tomato paste and then putting all that stuff on top? I was like, no, I'm using uh, sriracha and then I'm putting all the super hot stuff on top of that. And he goes, you're going to kill your stomach. <laughs> Bro, if we're going to make this a more regular, uh, I'm going to need you to get you like a, a blue Yeti blackout mic or at least a snowball or something. Cause uh, your your AirPods just ain't kicking. I got some bad news. We're gonna have to super glue this fucker back together. We might have to use some JB Weld because our Thanos keychain came disconnected. From- oh, yeah. I was pissed at my son, and I slung my keys on the floor. We could pick them up off the fucking floor. And, I'll sell uh, you one. You want to buy it? No. <laughs> All that info you dropped in super glue. That shit ain't going nowhere. Um, I've got some blue Loctite. If I put that on there, that shit really won't go anywhere. Or no, the red Loctite. Do I have that bag on here? Mm. I mean, if I put some blue Loctite on it, it should be good. But I got true super glue out here somewhere. Let's do this. Give me one moment. Oh my gosh. That is such a difference. What? The headset? No, this. Oh, yeah, I told you. Oh my gosh. It, it's <laughs> almost like an angel pissed in it before I drank it. It's 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 beautiful. Um That's why that's why I said if you don't like it, you could send it to me. You can suck a big blue dick. <laughs> that right there is the the next step up from Angel's Envy. I don't know what Angel's Envy is. They didn't have that in my liquor store. We were only in the ABC Select store today, which means we're only good enough to get select shit put out. Yeah. But, is my sound better now? Yes. Okay. Because you put on your damn gaming headset? Yeah. <laughs> Wait, it pulls out? Yeah. It it retracts into the headset. Well, pull that shit out. That's what she said. Oh, she said put it back in. What the fuck? <laughs> oh, man. So we used to do a series called Buy, Drink, Giveaway. What's this used to? We're doing it tonight, aren't we? Well, I mean, we are, and we're going to talk about the mystery boxes. We had some great mystery boxes go out last night. Now, we did the hot sauce throwdown where Joe, who has now challenged Travis and LD I, I is going to play. didn't along. challenge him. Tra- Travis just said that he could do more than me. You know, I saw some Pocky chips today, and I almost got some melon for you. I almost bought a thing of ghost ones when I was down at the store, but I was like, ah, I don't want to push my luck. So, a little bit of update getting ready for Comic Con. Comic Con. Yeah. That's not the one. If anybody wants to get a Jafar signed, I did get a red Jafar. That could be signed by Jafar himself, the voice actor from the original Aladdin, not the the new live role play bullshit they do now. now. I'm not saying it sucks. Did Dead Zone do his box? I don't. Did he get it yet? I don't know. Uh, I think he said he couldn't pick it up till Monday because it was coming into the PR box there. But we also got the glow case. Not only that, but I found the 
Star Wars Green Box Darth Vader Glow Chase somewhat in the wild today. Not really in the wild, but um, and Dead Zone did end up getting an awesome box. Um, I think if y'all know me, y'all knew I had basically five die cast Iron Man, my two uh, Neon Tech that aren't going anywhere, one and two. Yes, I've got my jacket zipped up, flash dirt not really showing because it's fucking cold. I turned my heater off earlier like a dumbass. Um, eBay has been really, really good today, though. Um, we hit the rebound hard. Um, I want to see Joe's reaction. I'm going to go ahead and tell him what I put in the box that we sent him last night because I want y'all to know how much. Man, you've been teasing that all day. That 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 patina Batman with the Gemini collectible sticker might be on the way to Jarhead as well. Oh, sh- dude. Which I paid up for and freaking loved, but the amount of support that Joe has given me. I need to start wearing makeup. My forehead's fucking shiny as hell. We just need to put a pop squad or a pop life sticker on it. Um, but the amount of support that I've gotten from Joe, um, it was my way of saying thank you. And I hated that Gemini collectible sticker. Fucking hate it. And you put it in there because every time you're like, do you want this one? I wouldn't take it, but I offered to pay for it. You sucker. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to sell it. But to give it to such a worthy cause of somebody that literally burned his asshole <laughs> for us the second time and is willing to make it a weekly event. We sent him that, and then we also sent him the um, two-pack of the Pocket Pops of uh, the Nightmare Before Christmas that he creamed over when we showed them on the camera. Dude, I almost bought those. I was like, ah, uh, but... And, and just to piss him off a little bit, we put a DBZ fake pin in the box. <laughs> uh, Discord is going crazy. I might have to turn this shit off. Um, yeah, I don't know. Oh, I need to grab that link. Um, hold on one second. I'm not even looking at the camera right now. Uh, I have I created the Pops Life family, which is a place for us to hang out. There's buy, sell, trade. They're showing off your collection. Um, you can say whatever the fuck you want to, as long as you don't become an asshole um, and start intentionally trying to upset people. I'm going to post this link and you can literally go join. Um, it's just for us to have fun and hang out. I don't know why it posted it from, Oh, it posted to YouTube and face. I don't want to show the Facebook link. I would have gone live on Instagram, but it didn't give me that fucking option. And, and one thing to remember guys, um, uh, you know, cause tonight is, you know, sell drink giveaway type thing. If somebody wants to buy something, don't try and snipe sales. We, we've we had it happen in the past going, hey, I got that. I'll sell it to you for 50 cents. But I will tell you, if you want to sell something, I have my phone here. Send me a message on Instagram and say, hey, bro, let me know you sent me a message. I got something I want to sell. If I'm not trying to sell it, I really don't mind telling you I got something to sell. The only thing I will tell you is Joe and I will not be held responsible if that transaction turns to shit. So, I mean, we're a family here. We like to have oh. fun. We like to hang out. My Another thing to mention, because uh, Chris mentioned it last night when he jumped in. Uh, if you guys aren't part of Gaslecast, go give them a check out. You know, on Facebook, uh, Instagram. Is fucking awesome, the guys. Yeah, like, they got they got a, a Mandalorian figurine made of real carbonized graphite, right? It's real carbonized graphite, right? That's what Chris said. It's not real carbonized graphite. <laughs> but they got a giveaway going on. So so go check them out. Give them a like, you know. We're trying to buy that damn thing uh, for 48 bucks from a guy that's local right now. Uh. I want it. If anybody has it and wants to do a trade, I will do any reasonable trade with any of you fucks because I love y'all. Hey, so we're happy that you're here, B Dog. I mean, we're all about you know hanging out, having fun. Uh, uh oh, <laughs> Chris posted. <laughs> yeah, he just posted a Tupac uh, out of the box look at Fye exclusive, even though it's a 
fucking world edition. So it's an overseas. Uh, who posted it. Dude, if y'all don't follow dis, D-I-S dot Funko on Instagram, y'all are missing out on finding out shit. Them and Funko Finders. Jay Funko, welcome, bro. If you've been with us, um, what is it you're getting up, Dave? You were talking about today. Oh, yeah. So um, we're trying to work out a trade with Patrick um, where – LBD is sending him uh, Blue Merciless Batman, and then we'll do our bullshit working out trades tomorrow. Then I'll pay him back. And he is sending me the um, Island Scarred Arrow. Uh, supposed to get John Diggle, too, but that fucker left it live on Macari and it sold. Hi, Christina. Uh, hey, so while you're doing that trade, you hey, Christina's in here. She's a sweetheart. Um, while you're doing that trade in the background, you have to have uh, Lowly Island Boys. It's not gay if it's in a three way playing in, in the background. That gets me demonetized whenever I finally do get monetized. <laughs> when you finally get monetized. Well, I mean, if it ever freaking happens. I want you to, <laughs> though, we set up the top up here. Let me, I'm going to get out of the way and turn the light up for a second. Let's go to the white light. Not that one, that one. All right, so we're really bright. We're flickering. Let's turn it down one, two. There you go. So I want y'all to see some of the stuff we have in stock, like Crash Bandicoot. We've got Jack Skellington and the Fountain Glow in the Dark box lunch. We've got the five DBZ fig pin bundle that Joe wanted, but I wouldn't sell them. <laughs> We've got Rick and Morty's King of Shit, Thanos TX previews. The Water Nook from Frozen, the Box Lunch exclusive. I saw the non-exclusive today. It looks like Harry Dog's ass. I'm, you know what? I'm thinking. I might have to get with you later about that DBZ thing. I'm thinking we take a pull together, and we make up for the uh, the total box of hot fecal matter that Doctor Applesauce got for, <laughs> for his Secret Santa. We all pull together to pay for those pot, those uh, fig pins and send him those fig pins. So here's the way our... Um, Even though he doesn't collect fig pins. But, sell drink know. giveaway works. If there's anything y'all are looking for, any lines, y'all let me know. We turned the light back up. Um, I've got a ton of freaking pop. I could even invite myself and join in on the phone and go show y'all what we have. That would actually be pretty cool. Yeah, we'll that's actually that. a, a cool thing. I just have to like turn the microphone off or put my AirPod in, and then I'm going to be hearing like multiple Double. feet. Or turn my mic off on the main one. Um, we're going to copy the clipboard. What's dumb is since I'm on a... Uh... No, dude, don't put that picture up. People will start leaving, man. My ugly mug runs people off. But it's my milkshake that brings the boys. Oh, come on. Where'd you go? I ain't hearing you. Hey, did you say in the broadcast when I left? What? When you go to another link, remember to click on another link and don't use the one you're live in. <laughs> okay. okay. I, don't. I, I just did a dumbass thing. He's a noob, guys. Don't pay him no attention. I'm not a noob. I've been doing this for like six months now. But the webcam is new and the microphone is new. And it not only being visible for 24 hours is new. Because <laughs> we've done some questionable shit on here before. Yeah. All right. I'm literally emailing myself the the freaking link and i'm gonna try to join it on my phone i do i could just forward you the link i just did it oh okay all right i wish i didn't have that glare on my glasses i wonder what happens if i turn my screen down one. there we go it's kind of gone so we're figuring all this out we might hang the ring light from the ceiling just to be dumb asses we don't know lbd 
Um, have you secured your plane ticket yet, sir? <laughs> so y'all know or might not know that my wife is a math teacher and I have a five-year-old with autism. Um, my wife was so proud because for an hour, all he did was played with the calculator and he couldn't figure out why it was always equaling zero. And it's because he would try to do like four minus four or four minus 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 four. And it would just always go to zero. Um, so he put, and then he puts in four minus minus four and it turns into eight. And he's like, how does that work? So they, they start talking and it's just funny watching a five-year-old playing with a calculator and getting a kick out of it. Um, we are, hey, did you already, uh, did you already take a look at that Iron Man? Which one? The one from Amazon. Oh, we've got it back there in the awesome shipping package. They sent it in. That's what I've been hearing. I'm like, wow, I pff, might actually have to get one. I'm not as scared of ordering from them anymore, especially when it's an exclusive. Dude, oh, LBD, people hate people like you. <laughs> he, he says he flies standby, so he just puts himself in the list the day before. Oh, it's pulling me in as a host. Shit. Um, I'm going to have to try to join it as not a host. So let Here, me go. hold on, hold on. Let me do this. Let me just forward that. Well, we're going to go into private. And then we're going to go. All right, fine. We're going to see if this works. Copy link. Or I could just turn my VPN on. <laughs> you know what? You might not like me for this, but I'm going to do this anyways. I don't care. What are you going to do? None you. Why the fuck would you turn your shit sideways? You can do that, and I can do this, or I can do that and bring you right back. I uh, hey, I it's sent working. The, it's working. I sent I sent the link to somebody. Who'd you send it to? Heather. Oh, is she going to come in with us tonight? I don't know. She's worth a shot. See if she clicks on it. <laughs> but I don't get priority over people who buy tickets. Now, eh. down here, Winter Jam's a Christian concert. Hey, I I will tell you one thing. There was one time I was flying, and I was wearing dress blues, and I got upgraded to first class, and they literally kicked the guy out of first class to put me in there, and it was awesome. Um, I've never kicked somebody out, but I've been upgraded quite a few times. Well, there was a guy, what he did is he, he upgraded his ticket from... Because if they don't sell out first class, they'll upgrade people. You know, you yeah. can you can upgrade for like I think like fifty bucks or something like that. Well, he upgraded, and I was in dress blues, and I was on that flight, and I walked on the plane, and the the stewardess or flight attendant. Uh, oh, dude, you gotta mute it. Oh, are we getting feedback? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I don't know why we're getting feedback though. We shouldn't, because I have this mic. Because your phone's picking up your computer. Oh. Oh. Ooh, it's like Scooby Doo. Hold on, hold on. And now we lost the sound off of your computer. Nope, because I had that mic muted. I just killed audio on this one. So gotcha. I'm going to hear it loop. I don't even need this now that audio's killed. Ooh, yes, I do. Uh, yeah, you do. Yeah, dude. Yeah, dude. Okay. We're still we're looping. We're figuring this out. We're fi Wait, no, now the loop stopped. So, all right. But my audio still turned off, so we won't loop. Okay. We got the but mic. No, on. so I, I jumped on this flight and I was in my dress blues, and they actually kicked the guy back into business class, um, refunded of refunded him his money, of course, and gave me first class. For free. That's freaking awesome. 
Dude, did you buy more than one of those tonight? Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Right, I, got, I got plenty of beer, and, dude, I got a whole liquor cabinet. Dude. <laughs> uh, I'm surrounded by assholes. <laughs> <laughs> you are what you eat, bro. No. Man, you, that movie reference went right over your head. Sure. I see a lot of movies where they talk about assholes. <laughs> Lieutenant <laughs> Asshole, Lieutenant Major Asshole. Oh my God, I'm surrounded by assholes. All right, so this is like the most ghetto way we could ever do this. No shit, flip your lights on, dude. You're not in front of your camera. It's gonna fuck with my camera. Hold on, let me. You put a quick on. switch on there, Jesus. It's weird here in the loop. Okay, um, we don't need that one. We don't need this. Don't, don't worry, guys. He's been in the dark for quite a while. <laughs> now I'm cleaning up my closet. <laughs> <laughs> Ain't that a Michael Jackson song? No, it's a fucking Eminem song, dude. <laughs> All right. Never so, mind. I don't know. We have... Like so many pop guys, um, and everything's different as you go further back. So this is just my wall of shit. And then we have even more down here. Whoa! That even works with those beers. And we've got God damn it! And all this is full cases of pop. Whew. We had at least six of to create a full case to get it out of the way. So, uh, oh yeah, military gets that before anyone. If you need anything, y'all need to let me know. Uh, this shirt I got it from. Uh, was it six dollar tees? I think. Like that good old happy fucking grimoire right there. <sighs> Let's get it charged up. That's cool. Oh. I, well, I tried to order the him and Bob Barker two pack, and it didn't work out. Can you hear me okay? Yeah, you're just it. It's kind of like you, you know, you're talking through it. The sheet. Is that better? Yeah. That's the good thing about a real microphone. Is I just turned up the gain. So we got Hot Wheels ID cars and Hot Wheels cars and Hot Wheels cars for some freaking reason. I don't know why. I got on a kick. We got a flock full of kitty back there. Quentin, why does that sound familiar? Wasn't Quentin in one of our other feeds that we did? Maybe. There's that Marilyn Manson. That was Joe last night. That right eye just closed. <laughs> Shut up, man. <laughs> it's not my right eye. It's my left eye. It's because it's reversed. Well, not reversed on here. What the hell? So, if there's anything y'all are looking for, let me explain what I mean by everything's different. So, let's just pull Marilyn Manson out of the way. And there's Albert Einstein. What the fuck? <laughs> and then you pull Captain America out of the way. And there's a Coca Cola bear. Mm, there's Harley Quinn and her beaver. Well, I would eat her beaver. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, hey, you gotta watch it. Christina's in here. She'll start smacking you around. Yeah, Quentin's been with us a bunch. That's what I thought. I think he's one of our ins- he's one of our Instagram. Well, something. that's the thing. Not everybody's Instagram name's the same as their their YouTube. So, like you, dumbass. Yeah, Joe for Joe Mama. Yeah, people are really going to want to check out anything on YouTube from that. This is the start of the addiction that has become I mean, everything fucking signed. And it's Joe's fault. <laughs> it's all Joe's fault. Dude, I told you. I was like, dude, just get one. You never know. And then you're like, I got to get signatures. So my Smile World boxes, I got two in. Friday, and my post office obviously sucks because the other six boxes won't be here till Monday. 
But I I we, forgot to get Smy World. We got two of the Super Saiyan Vegeta non exclusive so far. So if y'all want one of those, let me know. And I'm not looking at comments, so Joe. I see something. Uh, but we have. Oh shit. <laughs> Christina said thanks because I told you to watch your mouth. Um, I, I'm sorry. I say that. Oh, is that that 10 inch moose shoe that you got today? Uh, got that yesterday. Yesterday. Crash Bandicoot, King of Shit. Sorry, I have to say it. It's on the box. And it says with sound. But it doesn't come with batteries, and that you is know what? that is like a huge thing all over social media right now. Everybody's complaining that he didn't come with batteries, dude. He takes like six dollars worth of batteries. Not if you buy them on Amazon, it doesn't. Well, yeah, but then you got to wait for the shipping and all that. Oh, poor baby. I don't have to worry. It takes like I can almost get same day shipping. There is Disney villains Maleficent back there. We've got. A ghost town, a Ghostbusters pop town, and a Beetlejuice pop town hidden. And, uh, something back there. We got the legendary Turkish Mist, but I didn't get screwed with the gold one like everybody. I got silver. We got the. What? Yeah, yeah I got silver. Oh, that's spastic pops. I. <laughs> what? Oh, I got a notification. About an XL Nightmare Before Christmas thing, and it was from Spastic Pops. We, you don't like them, do you? Uh, Spastic Pops isn't bad. So. I just don't like Entertainment Earth or Pop in a Box. But you ordered from Entertainment Earth. Because they're the only people that got the fig pins. I would have had the fig pins. Yeah, but, well, you said you and I really did to entertainment earth believe it or not actually more more than you it was more like it was more like hey bank file fraud charges and let's get rid of these assholes yeah <laughs> well I told Nien that from uh, or, God, how the hell do you pronounce it not Nien uh, <coughs> Young I was telling him that from Shumi when he called me the other day. I was like, yeah, Entertainment Earth kind of filed some charges on his cards without his authorization. And he was like, ooh. I was like, yeah. You can see that. That's serial number. Can I get it in the picture? 001. That is my manufactured firearms. So that's what this building originally was. And then... Hey. Uh, we're on, we're on YouTube. Do you really want to show guns? Uh, pew pews. Pop protectors. Pop protectors. There but you that's go. That's what it was originally. And this is a two thousand dollar Matco toolbox full of high end tools. And instead, it's become a cooking <sighs> platform. Look at all the dents in the top of it from where I slammed the tape gun down. You know it. Sucks because I I look over at my computer and I can see the the lagged video and I see those and I'm like I want one so bad. Which one? <laughs> Which one do you think? Uh, the King of Shits. No, I'm talking about your pop protectors. Oh, uh, the lime green one. Yeah, I thought about uh, tagging you in a post of. Uh, Greg Cooks, but I was like, yeah, I don't know if he'd appreciate me trying to sell him a gun through my friend. Well, um, I do payment plans like the the tool truck, the, is what I tell you. The everybody. Super Bowl's next Sunday? Sure, I don't know. Well, Christina asked, anyone excited for the Super Bowl next Sunday? I, I didn't know it was... I, I literally could care less. I've already seen the commercial. Well, sort of seen the commercials. The lights behind really aren't that bad. No. I mean, it kind of bleeds everything out. There's nothing you can do with a light bar, a, a freaking fluorescent light. <clears throat> but if we turn that and we leave those, yeah, that gives us a little bit of light. Yep. Yeah. Yep. And then y'all really see the light ring in my glass. Look, Joe. 
Oh, it's like psychedelic. <laughs> mm. Just I really got to get him. I got to get another bottle of this. This stuff is so good. The smell of this is just so much different. Dude, it's sherry cask aged. I'm telling you. I, I told you that it's going to be a little more fruity. <clears throat> Just those real subtle hints of spices. Yep. Any anytime I see a good scotch or bourbon that's aged in cherry casks, I'm all about it because I know how mellow the flavors are going to be, yet really complex. So it says it's kept in a cask that's always kept at least half full. So they just been aging this for 15 years and adding to it and adding to it? No. No. Nope. Is well, is it, a, is it a single malt? It is. Okay. So that means it's not blended with other malt whiskeys and everything? Well, scotches. So it's... Um, they they put it in a cask and seal it for fifteen years. I'm more excited the Royal Rumble tomorrow. Oh, wrestling! Um, I'll send you a link, and it, it explains a lot of that stuff. Uh, there's there's some really cool videos on YouTube, but like, okay, so <laughs> here's a funny thing: you'll see a lot of these upper class whiskeys and scotches and stuff where they're blended whiskeys. Yeah. Blended means they have their batch, they age it, they do all this and that, and then they blend it with a bunch of other crap. So yeah, it could be a really good whiskey, but it's blended with a bunch of other stuff. What the fuck and... am I watching? Oh my gosh. This dude called Hunch Pops on Instagram. Literally to play on the video. Oh, can I do it? Stomps on a fucking pop. <laughs> Watch. Well, let us start over. So here he goes. Bam. Please tell me that's not a Tanya. I don't know what it is. I I can't take much more watching these people stomp a Tanya. I will gladly pay somebody like 60 to 80 bucks for a Tanya Rather than have them freaking stomp it. Well, Adventures of Ash Cheeks, Ash, A-S-H, which is probably one of my favorite names. Do I have a favorite Venom Pop? Um, hmm. I really like the 10-inch Venomized crew. I'm not even going to lie to you. I can't wait. I Mine just shipped today, so. I haven't even been able to pre-order it yet. Have you seen the actual Venom group pop, like the the regular one, like out of box? Yeah, no, in box. Do you want, not out of box. Do you, do you want to see it out of box? Don't be an asshole. I'm not. I just said, do you want to see it out of the box? You know, you don't pull pops out of the box. Well, I, I don't pull that. pops out of the box and lick them like some people. I did not lick that pop. Not more than once. <laughs> but I do kind of want to lick Hot Chick. Because they were even nice enough to put white underwear underneath. Oh, the you see who just joined the Discord? Uh, no. I closed my Discord. So I, I love how everybody, when they join, is a little bit different. <laughs> They're like, so-and-so joined the Discord. Everybody looked busy. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> Except mine. Mine was like, what? Really? You said you. So I managed to get a hold of two Shannon Elizabeth Tops cards off eBay. The blue one is 19 to 33. And the red one is like 20 or 39 out of 99. And this is her American Pie photo. I don't know how well this is going to come in. We can always app share the Discord and I can show you this photo. Wait, I took you with my fucking phone. <laughs> I still that work. I'm not on a Mac. On a Mac, I could just airdrop this shit. Uh, I'm going to grab another drink. I'll be right back. 
drunkard. I can still hear you through my headphones, a hole. Mm, suck it. Um, I'm trying to figure out the best way to get this to me. Um, I guess I could always just email it. So I found these for $6 and 99 cent a piece on eBay or on Amazon came from the same place because we were going back and forth. Shannon Elizabeth's going to be at the galaxy con Richmond, which is oh, right. where, um, average pop guy also known as Chris is going to get a bunch of sign shit for me. So I can do my awesome mystery boxes that will go live for comic con Alabama in June, but I will also I will also be nice enough to give my Discord folks, my Instagram folks, and my Patreon folks a chance to buy these before the show starts. Right, we're saving that photo. We're gonna. What is just that, dude? Don't do the hot sauce again. My nose has not stopped running today, and I think it's like sympathy. Are you eating cold pizza? Yeah, you're an asshole. Cold barbecue, pepperoni, and bacon pizza with <laughs> ghost pepper and chocolate bootless sauce. Is that like hair of the dog? Is that what that is? Mm -hmm. I figured. I might have to run inside real quick. Can you keep him entertained until I come back? Uh, maybe. <coughs> yeah. A little much? Uh, I, we don't have to just be a badass. I wasn't, I wasn't watching the dropper <coughs> on the pizza. It's so like the first bite had all the drops on it. All the drop. All the drop. That's not what I want it to be, though. Um, that's going to show pictures I don't want y'all to see. Not I don't want to see them either. <clears throat> oh, I mean, man. It's not like people's driver's licenses and shit in there. Dude, uh, <coughs> this bottle was three quarters full when I started all this. It's literally down to there now. Hold on, I can't see it. But hold on. Uh, we're going to share. Well, the bad thing is. <clears throat> All right, let me see something real quick. Um, it's down that? to there. Yeah, you're just wasting all your shit. I you know. I paid a lot of good money for this. What are you looking at? <clears throat> so I want to show you all these cards I picked up. And then I want to minimize the other photos because y'all don't need to see other people's personal information. There we go. So let's... Does it actually show you the picture I'm looking at? No, it just keeps showing you that. Um, I need. Yeah, y'all don't need to see that. <laughs> um, that's got yeah. Um, oh, I know what we can do. I'm a dumbass. I didn't think of this originally. We can open up disc. That's not Discord. That's Logitech. Fuck. Close window. Good boy. Yeah, Christina, cold pizza is good. I'm but about to go get the the stuff I put on. on. Do any of y'all have the privilege of having a chicken salad chick close to you? Have a what? A chicken salad chick. What the heck is a chicken salad chick? Exactly. Hey, you know what I bought some more of tonight? Penis sauce? Those hot, well, they're supposed to be flaming hot lime chips. There we go. Look at that. So that is our Shannon Elizabeth page. We're going to bring those in full screen. 
Uh, I should be able to zoom that if I go back to it. Uh, to do, 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 do. So that is oh, yeah. Shannon Elizabeth. The blue card is like out of 33 cards. It's like 13 or something like that. This one's like 39 out of 50 cards, something like that. Freaking awesome. Um, I got those for me and Travis to get signed because we were talking the cast of Jay and Silent Bob minus Silent Bob is going to be there. And we were talking about ways to get her signature on shit that would actually be cool. And we couldn't find a pop. And we didn't want to just get it on a Jay and Silent Bob pop. And they don't make a fucking, excuse me, sorry, Christina. They don't make an American pie pop, sadly, and I didn't want to get her to sign like an empty apple pie shell. Or um, you don't gotta worry about the mouth, Christina. It was the whole Harley Quinn comment. What about it? <clears throat> what did I say? <laughs> you did Harley Quinn with beaver pop thing, and um, uh, so I don't know, like Harley Quinn was my like. Of all the fictional characters, Harley Quinn is my fantasy. I think that's a good way to say it. I am in love with the character of Harley Quinn. Not so much Margot Robbie, because I think she should keep her mouth shut. <laughs> oh, darn, you can't see me putting the drops on that chip. <laughs> yeah, you got to lighten the room back up before you do that. So I'm I'm kind of hungry. I, I think I'm gonna run inside and get my wheat thins and my chicken salad and come back out. It is sassy Scotty is what they call it, the flavor I eat, and it is fresh chicken. They make this chicken in house with ranch, cheese, and bacon in it. Oh my gosh, dude! This is like heaven on a cracker. What? Huh? <laughs> you just zoned out on us. I was reading the comments. I'm sweating, dude. I started in on the hot sauce again. What can I say? So B Dog's pops. Does that mean you sell pops or you're just B Dog and you have pops? One thing I don't like though is it won't tell me who's in here with us. I can't know. Everybody's on YouTube, though. Not there's a single one there's 10 people watching. But it doesn't tell me who. Mm. I wonder if I click private chat. No, that's just with y'all. Yep. I like y'all and all, but uh, I don't need y'all to. Uh. Huh. You know what the sad thing is? I'm sitting here stuck drinking beer because ain't nobody bought nothing yet. So, who needs something tonight, whether it's an overvalued mystery box, because I don't sell crap mystery boxes, nor do I sell you a box and guarantee PPG. I guarantee PPG plus or PPG plus plus plus, depending on how I'm feeling. And the two guys that bought $50 mystery boxes last night, that was shipped. So like 42 bucks each got four pops one of them got five pops um and he really wanted the king of shit and he got the king of shit with four other pops the other one got hooked up with an awesome setup pop king paul just posted a photo it's, it's too bad we didn't get that chick who won the luau mystery box in here she could tell uh, people about how much she loved that one you sent her i think that's linda that was in here and commented really early on or lisa noble I want to say that's her. Oh, no, it wasn't her. It's Linda somebody or other. Oh, his he just posted a picture that his boxes are live. Yeah, I don't care. I can't afford a $450 box tonight. If I hadn't gone and spent all the money I spent today, I could have. <laughs> oh. So, who needs some stuff? That's the real question. Typically, we don't give away until we have 10, and we bring the wheel in. Um, Jay, you asked for 
king of shit. So typically I let people choose their grail if they want to. Um, you got king of shit, bro. I mean, you got either two more or four more. Honestly, I can't remember. Uh, it was a lot, though. Maybe it was three more. But somebody said no anime, please. And that was Ted, the sub guy. Uh, mm. And it was always cool to ship to sub guy. I was looking for um, Salty, the um, the bird, the spastic plastic bird. Oh, the, yeah, 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 the seagull. The rifle eagle. Eagle. The eagle. I was going to send it to him. I can't find it. Um, mm. That's like my mascot being in the Navy because, you know. I bet you he's on the very top shelf in the back on the bottom. No, I literally moved every single pop. I dug. Um, I looked for him for a good 45 minutes this morning. Trying to beat the mail. We shipped out two large bags and three massive boxes. So, if you want mystery boxes, I always do them. Um, Jay, if you want another mystery box. Christina, if you want a mystery box. LBD, if you want to come in live and do your shopping with us, we'll give something away based on your shopping, bro. But Joe, can you entertain him for a second? I'm going to go grab my food. I'll be right back. Yeah, go ahead. We'll talk shit while you're gone about talk you. Shit about me. <laughs> hey, what else uh, did you to grab while I was inside? What did y'all want me to What did y'all want to see? Um, uh, I got Iron Man right here. I don't know. Uh, da, 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 da. I don't remember. My brain's gone to shit today. Uh, well, B Dog, one thing you got to remember is uh, Jason doesn't just sell like expensive mystery boxes. Pretty much, you know, you want to spend 20 bucks on a mystery box, he'll make one for you, he'll figure yeah. it out. If you want a single pop box, bro, it costs me four bucks is what I charge to ship a single pop. So if you do 14 shipped, I'm going to guarantee you a minimum of 20 PP. Eh, we'll say 15 PPG because sometimes it's hard to find a $20 pop in the price range you want. But I'm going to throw some stickers in there. Might get some other little goodies in there. So, dude, if you want to do a single pop box, you can PayPal me 14 bucks and I'll put you a single pop box together. Guaranteed. You tell me what line you want it to be in, and I'll do my best to put a big ass smile on your face, like the one Joker had when Heath Ledger cut it into his freaking face. You want to know how I got these scars? <laughs> my father. I want that yeah. damn DX11. I'll be right back. I'm muting my mic. Yeah, hurry up. You can't teach some people's kids, you know? No, it was funny. I was I was on the uh, well on Instagram live with Jay today. He was going hunting and everything, and he found some pretty good deals, you know, for some stuff he wanted for his collection and everything. But for the most part, it wasn't anything that he could, you know, give. Well, I guess he could have gave it away, but he doesn't like giving away just junk. But. Uh, yeah, it was, it was funny because he went out. He was just going to go to Best Buy. He wasn't going to spend any money. And the next thing you know, he ends up spending too much because <laughs> that's how he is. Because he knows if he can find it, he can move it on to other people and everything. And <laughs> sometimes he just gets carried away. Uh, let's see. I don't see any other things. What the heck? There we go. But, yeah, and, you know, everybody that sits there and they're all worried and everything, I'm still alive from last night. I love hot sauce. I love hot stuff. I love the torture. It sucks at the time, especially when people buy expensive mystery boxes, like, What's his face and make me drink whiskey and eat hot sauce? And you got to unmute your mic, Jason. Unmute your mic. I did. There you go. Huh. 
Why you got to show us that big ass zit? It's not a zit. I mashed it today. It's not just a, a red spot. Um, <laughs> it's basting. I swear, it's basting. Um, LBD. Um, I'm gonna shoot you an Instagram link with the thing if you want to jump in and buy your box. We can go to the other phone and bring it back in too, or we can just bring box in front of you and you say yes or no. We Is he buying a- another box? Do I? Is he buying another box tonight? Well, LBD didn't buy one last night. Oh, I thought you. I thought you were gonna let it. Oh. He didn't do it last night. Um, LBD is the kind of guy that he. We just go live for about an hour together. Well, not really live. We go private chat, and he says, "Well, yeah, I want that one, and I want that one, and that one, and that one." And we add up PPG, and then I take some money off in the end. Hey, this is chicken salad chick. This is like my lunch for like four days at work, and I'm digging into it at uh, almost 11 o'clock at night, my time. Oh, it's a little bit of chives in it, cheddar cheese, ranch dressing, and bacon with fresh chicken. See, that's the thing. Like, you didn't give me much time of heads up on the whole life thing because yeah. I was going to eat dinner before. I feel bad eating in front of people. I don't. You know? We're normal folks, guys. We're not one of those 100,000 subscriber YouTube folks that have to have a uh, filming guy and everything else. I just put a $100 webcam on my crappy computer. And put a hundred dollar mic up, and we'll bam, off to the races we go. Crap! It's hard when you're like twisted over trying to put hot sauce on pizza. Doesn't make it easy, you know. Hey, we got a thumbs up, and that looks like a Facebook thumbs up. What? We got a Facebook like. Holy crap! We got someone watching from Facebook all by themselves. <laughs> oh, you're you're streaming on Facebook too? Uh huh. Oh, so Facebook might end up shutting down Pop Life Toys if I'm not careful. No crap. Well, eh, they don't have a problem with cursing. It's just if you show the pew pews. Hmm. You can show them, you just can't post prices. <laughs> Bro, my nose hurts just looking at that. I woke up this morning with my nose running for the first time in weeks. Oh, LBD, sorry, bro. Dude, it's it's just uh it's just like super hot uh Buffalo sauce. No, it's like it's, super hot ass burn sauce. It ain't, it ain't nothing, nothing, you know, too crazy. It makes me think about the stomach virus after you shit for like the 15th time and then you're just shitting stomach acid and every time you wipe, you cry. You've been seeing all the posts about that new Chinese disease, the coronavirus? No, but I don't want to talk about it. Well, they say they may have figured out a cure for it. Lyme's disease. I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. I don't know if I want to know. Uh, LBD. China has a new virus. It's called the coronavirus, but the joke is, you know, coronavirus, Lyme disease. Corona. How many people do you think are going to order pizza after watching me sit here eat it? I don't know, but I can guarantee you nobody's going to go to the kitchen and make chicken salad. See, you say chicken salad, and I automatically thought romaine lettuce, chicken, and all that stuff. No, that's stupid, bro. What did I just do? I don't know. Only you this. did put the Discord link up on the screen. I did. It's been there. 
Dude, put a shirt on, bro. No oh, shit, yeah. <laughs> sweetie. I mean, are oh, we going to have to show our nipples again, man? Damn. I'm not showing the nipples, man. I'm just showing this over. Oh, shit. <laughs> no, Joe. Relax, bro. I'm used to being at home. Honestly, you know what? the biggest thing I always get to is like, you never have a shirt on when you're at home. I swear. I've met, I've met my girlfriend's mother like this. Just like this. On webcam? Yeah. Did you swipe right or left? <laughs> what are you talking? I never swiped anything. So you order a box for me every week on payday. Yeah, but this this week is probably going to be a little bit different. So probably you had to fly out of the country. Yeah, it's all that that traveling, man. That shit, that shit hurts your pockets. Pop King <laughs> Paul already sold out. Yeah, with four hundred. Yeah, the fact that he sold out a four hundred and something dollar box is insane. But did you see the teaser post he posted? I did. I I saw it for a minute, but I I got I was busy at the time, so I didn't look at it really, really. But I really don't have to look at it because I've literally heard about his boxes like a million times. They're always over overvalued and. Uh, uh, the top of it is overvalued. Mm. Um, but I guess. in general, it's not overvalued because I've had quite a few boxes from him. Um, well, never really got the value I was hoping to get. In fact, was disappointed a couple times. It is. I guess it happens, man. Not like. I'm not endorsing or anything, but I like I said, I've heard good things about it. That's all I can say. What happened to Joe? I put a shirt on, although all I, now I look like a floating head to some soul. Ah, man. Oh, man. What happened? I was eating pizza and pizza. Why is he doing <laughs> he's eating, I can see what he's doing in the bottom of my screen. It's just grayed out. He's okay. flipping the bird and jerking off right now. <laughs> <laughs> He knows I can see him now. <laughs> I can't hear what you're saying, but I can see. Yeah, him. we can't. Yeah, we can't hear you. Yeah, but we can definitely. He well, he can see you. So, what do you what need you this week, bro? Billy Madison, Happy Gilmore. No, honestly, I was thinking. I love that. I love those movies and stuff like that, man. But I don't think I'm gonna go for the for the pops. I really don't. I don't know. Have you seen the pops? I have seen them. I have seen them. Yeah. I have seen them. And it's just I one of those things I'm like, eh. I ordered the six inch of him in the bathtub. And That's, I didn't even know that was a six inch. Well, uh, it's bigger, so it's kind of weird. And I ordered the um Scuba Steve. I basically ordered every one hot topic had available last night. Basically anything Adam Sandler, you think? Yeah, and then a bunch of other shit, too. I mean, you know how we do it. All the Venom Pops that were available. I think the only Venom, like I said, the only Venom one I'm probably going to go for is Groot, Punisher, and Miles. I don't know. Doctor Strange looks pretty damn cool. He looks cool, but I'm not, I'm not a fan of Doctor Strange at all. I do like Punisher, and I do like Miles. And uh, what's the other one I said? I can't even remember. Oh, Groot. And I do like Groot. So that's why I like I like Venom so and I like the combination of them looks awesome as well. So that's why I went there. But honestly, right now the the main one I, I was gonna go look for it, but I was like I didn't have time and I said something happened with the trans with the transfer today. So I, they told me I have to wait till tomorrow and tomorrow's fucking Sunday. It's fucking annoying. Good, I know you're good for it. No, no, you told me, but I'm just saying I I just don't. Pay me my money, you know what I'm saying? Like, give me my money. <laughs> like, you know, that's, that's I hate. I mean, when, and when people owe me money, bro, I, my, my own father told me he'd rather owe the government than owe me because I harass you more than they do. <laughs> Owing me money is not a good thing. I'm sorry. I, that's why I don't really lend it out like that. <laughs> I really don't. 
Because then you need it, and then you're stuck. Leave somebody else's head there. What is this? Yeah, Joe eat? Y'all can't see Joe right now, but he's on like his seventh piece of pizza. Wait, did Joe just want to go eat in peace? <laughs> he's such right a liar. Now. Such a liar. I told him yeah. that you were making jerking off motions, and we don't do that. I can hear you when you're doing all that. But they can't hear you, but I can see you. <laughs> you didn't see me licking my nipple, though, and flicking it. Hey, Christina already said, is this becoming Magic Mike? Somebody's got a whistle. Uh, <laughs> LBD, it's what? got to be you, man. It wouldn't have before. What? Well, I, didn't, I, had a, I, had, I didn't have a shirt on. Maybe that's what she was saying. Uh, no, turn your speakers down a little bit. You got a feedback. You got a loop. Oh no! Because he ain't got because he ain't got headphones. I do. Yeah, turn. Where are you getting the loop from? I don't know. I got headphones on. Sorry. I don't know. Joe's gamer on us. What's really bad is we'll be on the uh, Xbox talking, and then I hear you guys on the Xbox, and I'll just turn off my Xbox and go about what I'm doing. <laughs> We're mid conversation. I'm like, where did Joe go? And they're like, I know. I'm sitting there. I'm like, oh yeah. By the way, click. I'm like, really? Okay. I think I think I fixed it. Is it fine now? Yeah. You know what it was? I was playing the video. I think at the same time, but I don't know why you can hear it because I had headphones on. It for you. This is what's good. If you take the Papa John's butter, garlic butter stuff, and you put hot sauce oh. in it. Stop it. That's good. Iron stomach, man. I understand why the VA gives you so much stomach milk. <laughs> <laughs> so, the the nice blue pill to help you? Huh? No, no, he's talking about my stomach meds, not my heart meds. Oh, okay. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Trying to figure out where to put this frame. I haven't framed the picture in years. I feel old. What picture? Picture of my girlfriend. Oh. Yeah, but I got a better one. I got a picture over here of my of my aunt screaming on the mummy ride. I don't know if you can see that. You know what you should do? Frame the picture of your girl. Put it on the fridge. And then when she goes, why is my picture on the fridge? Just tell her, well, because I wanted to think about you where you should be. <laughs> well, yeah. No, I, I didn't if she gets mad, if she gets mad, grabs and you know, grabs something like she's gonna hit you, toss her a knife. Woman instincts kicked in. She'll start making your sandwich. That's fucked up. That's fucked up. Uh, <laughs> you can barely see my eyes. I'm so fucking dark. I'm the one with the white tank top. Yeah. Hey, <laughs> Jeez, man. That's that thing is like a beacon. And then this one right here. That shit was fucking hilarious. I love the mummy ride. I remember when, when it first came out, uh, I was like, I didn't go on it the first day. I wanted like maybe like a couple weeks later. Well, we dropped down to a whopping six, folks, but it's okay. I'm here to have some fun and eat some chicken salad, obviously. This. Have you, you haven't put any batteries on the king of shit yet? No. Or well, did you not keep them on I don't know what it sounds like. I'm guessing you can go to YouTube and hear what it sounds. I'm guessing it's a flush and tool it. I would love it if it's like the grunt noise of someone trying to take a shit. Uh, so it, it probably is because the thing about Rick and Morty is they're really like grotesque. Like they're they're so that's a fucked up cartoon. Like it's really bad. So I love clamshell packaging and I hate it. I hate putting clamshell packaging back together. Oh yeah. Try doing it with one hand though. It's annoying shit. All right, I'm yeah. going to full screen for a minute, guys. So yeah. this bad boy right here is the Iron Man. I wish they'd made the little flame part glow. He's got the flame boosters on his back. He's got the detail on his knees that we don't normally see. This is a Mark Seven. Um, he's got what looks like the bullet hole or the wound in his chest. He's got the wounds on his arm. 
He's got some scuffing on his knee right about cheer. I don't know how well y'all can see that. And on his face, he's got these two indentions up here. So they did the best they could to make him look kind of battle damaged. Um, but they got his fist clenched, and you can see all five fingers, which is nice. They've got. I'm surprised that's the base on the back of his hands. And then the base looks super freaking awesome, too. Yeah, so that's that. I'm really surprised. The, the dust stirring up as he's starting to take off. And then right there is your link in piece where it looks like Hulk will be next. Yeah, he is. I pre ordered him yesterday. I forgot. I don't know what I'm talking about. So, all in all, super impressed with this pop. He joined my Hot Toys case. By the way, that's him landing, not taking off. Oh, yeah, that's right. Because he's coming down into it. Yeah, because yeah, it's supposed to be from the New York scene where they're all in a circle. Yeah, and Hulk should be screaming. Like, they should make him vocalize so we can hear him screaming at the Chitari. Those actually would that, that would have been cool if they had that, like, become a sound when it's put together. So the Mark Seven I have, he is on his knees with his knee in the neck of a dead Chitari soldier. Or alien, whatever you want to call him. The one that's sticking the middle finger? Yeah, my wife told me to put it down, but she's short, so she doesn't notice the top shelf very often. I put it back. I'm about to say, did she see it? <laughs> yeah, she said that is inappropriate. You need to pull that down. So I pulled it down, and then when she wasn't looking, I put it back up. <laughs> All right, how often does she really look at it? I don't know, but these things are selling for like crazy money on eBay. I bet. So and they're not even really sold out. It's stupid yeah. that it's the. Back in stock February 4th, and if you know anything about Amazon, they'll say February 4th. It could be like February 24th because Funko gives you a estimated date. They never give you a guaranteed date. Okay, the whistle's getting really bad. I want to try something. All right, we just muted LBD's mic, and the whistle went away. Yeah, so there's something going on. LBD, bro, it's definitely you because when I muted your mic, the whistle went bye-bye. You want me to drop out and come back in? Uh, drop out for a little while. I might bring you back in because it's too small with three people. Just like that. All right. And I'm trying to find like oh, yeah, the I know. sound. I'm trying to find the sounds for that stinking pop, but I can't find them. I want to play that scene again and just get so excited. What's up, Kenneth Bird? So, who wants to buy a mystery box? Anywhere from 10 to 50 I, I really don't want to do a $200 box, but I can. Um, I end up having to pull grails out of my collection, and I don't like to. My Marvel sticker shelf is quite empty right now. <laughs> and Marvel has taken a dive in PPG at the moment. Uh, as soon as Black Widow drops, it's going to jump back up. Oh, man, you're drinking it way too fast. Dude, I'm taking tiny little sips. But I don't typically drink while I eat. That shows you right there I'm a lightweight. Uh-oh. 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 <laughs> so my gauntlet was on oh, the... I, I love... Again, it's somewhere out in the grass. I went and got the super glue. I was going to glue that shit back on. JB Weld it. Well, it it's missing, bro. It's going to be in the grass. It's not like it's going to grow legs and walk How away. Give me that when I sent you back. But you never took it out of the package. How about you stop sending me fucking DBZ? Uh, 10 inch Spyro, bro. Done. Um,. Let's go pull pop price guide. Um, we're going to do a special tonight. Let me see what it's selling for because I know what I bought it for. I'm going to hook you up. Yeah, I was looking at that in the store the other day. I was like, oh. I don't think I spelled his name right. Oh, maybe I did. Okay. There's a gal at the VA who loves Spyro, and I'm like, dude, that's an easy in right there. Nope. All right, so here's what I'm going to do for you tonight because it costs about 10 bucks to ship a 10-inch pop. 
Hopefully, the way I ship, it's PPG is 35. How about we do 35 shipped and then we give something away? So, literally, I'm giving it to you for 25 plus shipping because I was able to buy it on a GameStop deal. But of course, to get free shipping, I had to spend what is it, 35 or more to get free edge shipping? So, I bought a bunch of stuff. If you want that pop, bro, uh, 35 shipped inside the U.S. Let me clarify that. Is that B Dog's first purchase from us? I don't know. Maybe. Well, from you, I should say, not us. I mean, it's kind of you too. You got paid last night. Shut up. Who hired talent last night? <laughs> uh, what? You were hired talent last night. <sighs> Need to sign up for the circus for the stuff I did last night. Uh -uh. I'm not Magic Mike. I'm a Chips Ahoy dancer. I stole that from Larry the Cable Guy, by the way. Oh, uh, he says he gets paid Wednesday, so darn. Who said that? Uh, B Dog. All right, well, just let me know. Joe got a tip. Yeah, he was definitely Magic Mike. If y'all see me sliding out of the camera, I'm turning off my mic. It's because my nose is running. I don't want y'all to see me blowing it. So I'll be right back. Yeah, I had to listen to it earlier. He was in the bathroom. It was loud. He has a very big nose. That's the Jew in me. But that sounded really perverse that you had to listen to it. I was in the bathroom. We were talking on the phone. I had an AirPod in, which kills most of the noise. And l unless you're blowing and the reverberations are going through your face, because that's how it picks up what sound to transfer in. Well, you know, I mean, your kid wasn't like sticking it in his ear or nothing. He just had was holding on to it. So what? What the fuck are you talking about? Your AirPod when you went in the bathroom to blow your nose. Um, I went in the bathroom to take a shit. No, I was talking about earlier when you were at Barnes & Noble to blow your nose. Oh, yeah, the kid. Had, oh, okay. What did he do? He was just standing there. And he was holding it. and He was kind of like dumbfounded. And he was like, hi. And I was like, hey. Now, that's yeah. Adam, my nine-year-old um, that's been diagnosed with basically what would be known as Asperger's. But he's got... They call it social pragmatic communicative disorder, which basically means he doesn't socialize well. Unless it's dead. I want this. Let's build this. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he was all about that truck today, man. He he wanted it. Oh, when I saw it was level three out of four, I'm like, nope, I'm good. <laughs> it's, like, Hulk it's like, sorry, Addison, but your dad's going to have trouble with this one. I need to put the hot sauce away because I keep looking at it. Because I learned last night, do not do hot sauce, then a shot of whiskey, then hot sauce, then a shot of whiskey because it messes you up. Now, I don't want to gross any of y'all out, but I am going to tell y'all something Joe told me. As drunk as he was, he did remember not to jerk off last night because of the hot sauce in his hands. Oh, man. Got to make shit up. Me, no. I showed him the, I farted and I pooped a little bit. <laughs> Thanks, you sent me. Well, I didn't poop myself. It was kind of one of those, burp. oh, nope, that's not a fart. Now, if I had to shit myself, I wouldn't have said nothing to you. <laughs> So, if y'all have never been a part of our channel before, on Instagram we do this, but every hour we end, and typically it's a really awkward situation when it ends. And then Boy, we so comfortable again. with us. It's not that we feel comfortable with everybody. It's just that's a military thing. There's, yeah. there's no boundaries. He was a Marine. I was Navy. 
he did things with the rifle we're not going to talk about. And he went down on things with dudes. Yeah. And when I say he went down, he went way down. I was on a submarine, guys. Not not what you're thinking. Yeah, a long, hard tube full of semen. And he <laughs> went down on it. And you spent a lot of night with nothing but your rifle barrel. Tent. What are you talking about? I was a Marine, dude. We could walk into any Dairy Queen and dress blues and take a woman home. You put a sailor in dress white, you can't touch it. <laughs> oh, yeah, okay, Popeye. There's only two cartoon characters that wore dress whites, and that was Popeye and Donald the Duck. Popeye wanted a chick that was flat chested and couldn't. Yeah. It, yeah. Let's not, you, let's, let's not go there. Posters from World War II. What the fuck was the dude wearing when he dipped the woman back and kissed her? It was fucking dress whites. Uh -huh. And? And dude, they're so freaking comfortable too. It's almost like wearing pajamas with a belt. Yeah. That's one thing I will not say about dress blues, man. Those things are uncomfortable. Oh, our dress blues suck too. They were 100% wool. And so... You had the the U that you would wear in the front that was 13 buttons. And that's how you button it. So if you were drunk and you had to piss, you had a problem. And there was this little corset shoelace in the back, and that's how you tightened it. So if you had to piss, you either undid the shoelace in the back and pulled them shits all the way to your ankles like you're a kid learning how to piss at a hurdle for the first time, or you undid half the flap. What you did is you got... A little further into it, you realize you keep the bottom row button, then you button the top two. So if you got a piss, you undo one side, pull the flap down, and you, you have access. See, that's the thing. The Marine Corps dress blues, dude, those things are tailored to you. So it's like there's no cheating that, that uniform. Yeah. yeah. Oh, man. I hate to say it, but that whiskey hit. And it's like a fireball right now. It hit that hot sauce and it's like screaming. I don't know, dude. YouTube's kind of dead when it comes to like this. I'm thinking we have better luck with Instagram for people looking to we run five to six on Instagram. We got eight on YouTube right now. And I like this. I have the freedom to share screens. I'm not on my phone. I mean, we're just hanging out, guys. If y'all want to see a hot sauce challenge once a week, every couple of weeks, oh. you just want to come have fun. Y'all want to buy affordable mystery boxes where you know you're going to be happy when you open it. Y'all want to buy pops for me directly under PPG. I hate paying PayPal fees and I hate paying eBay fees. I'm a top-rated plus seller with 100% positive feedback, and I've done... 700 something transactions in six months. Um, top rated plus power seller. So I've had. Not to mention, Lou, I just gave away one of your mystery boxes and the lady just loved it. Yeah, she said she's ordering a $200 mystery box for me on payday. I'm thinking, shit. Because people <laughs> don't want a bunch of cheap pops in a $200 mystery box. No. I've never been one to collect really expensive pops. So I'm going to have to start holding on to the expensive ones. The most, the absolute most comfortable uniform I have. With the uniform you couldn't be seen by the public in. You couldn't wear it topside, which means standing outside of the submarine. And you couldn't walk to work in it. It was our coveralls. We called them poopy suits. Don't ask me why. I don't know where the phrase came from. But it was a jumpsuit that was soft as like 
pajamas with a belt in the middle of it. Yeah. See, we weren't allowed to wear belts with our coveralls. We didn't. We had to wear a t-shirt. And typically when you were in those, we got to wear tennis shoes. Yeah. Like when we were underway, because you didn't want the noise of the boots, we wore tennis shoes. Had to be close toe, close heel, tennis shoes and socks. But other than that, they didn't care. Some of the officers would wear dress shoes. Um, unless you were doing one or two of the jobs, um, you didn't wear boots because boots make noise and noise on a submarine, especially a boomer where your goal is to stay undetected because when people find you, that's bad shit. There's another channel called Booze and Pops that basically does the same thing as this. They were live tonight, too. They are oh, still they live, too. another one up? Uh, wait, is that... That's oh booze and pops. That's not pop drunk. Yeah, that's that's a different one. Um, but yeah, we're we're just drinking because we're drinking. I mean, we I sell something. It's a little different. I don't typically drink either. Yeah, um, but you just got that brand new scotch. So, I mean, I didn't pour very much. Well, yeah, because you're not supposed to. You're supposed to sip on it. If we need to go hard. <laughs> oh, God. Lead slinger. So I thought this shit was going to be good. This is made by veterans. It's put out by Matt Best and some of the guys from Black Rifle Coffee Company. It's got American flag in the background. It's got an eagle carrying an AR-15. What's sad is Chris, Travis got it for me out of Commie, California and shipped it to me. And I go to take one sip and it's like drinking like stuff you clean. Oh, dead zone. Dead zone. Oh, no. Dead zone. Don't spend money tonight. No hot sauce. I'm, not drinking, I'm drinking hot sauce tonight. <laughs> Only booze tonight, dead zone. And chicken salad. It's been good. He's eating cold pizza. I'm eating chicken salad. Yeah, cold pizza and hot sauce, but you know. I ain't drinking it. Dude, you zone. need to get a you need to get a small bottle. I mean, hell, I'll I'll ship you an eight ounce sample bottle of if what? you're willing to uh, let me try some of that. Of what? The lead slinger. Sure. You know what? I'll, I'll make you a deal. I'll ship you an eight ounce sample bottle, and I'll put some of my buddy stuff in it, and that way you can try it. And then you can ship me some of that lead slinger. Um, Dead Zone just got paid. We, we yeah, do hot uh, talk tonight. Uh, fuck off, Dead Zone. <laughs> Jesus, he just got paid. That's that's scary because he spent a bit with you last night, and he just now got paid. That. I did my very first back-to-back -back shots last night, and that second shot, oh, my gosh. I, almost Dude, I don't it. even want to hear it. I don't even want to hear it. I, I didn't party like Marines. I was married when I went in the Navy, and I'm still married to the woman I went in with. All right, so just so you guys know, he's sitting here bitching about doing back-to-back -back shots of whiskey. <laughs> I had – oh, they're in the sink. I had freaking uh, – shot glasses full i have one full of hot sauce and we're we're talking i had one that was jalapeno and uh chocolate bootla it had the eyedropper one um where'd it go i had some of this in there what was it like a full eyedropper and then some once you put in an yeah eyedropper and and this this right here this is ghost pepper and maruga scorpion sauce. Then you said uh, that's two million on the Scoville scale. It's about two million. I think it's like one point eight million. Um, I had some Dave's insanity sauce, and I had all kinds of stuff. And then you slam that, awesome. slam that shot. Then I slam a shot of whiskey. Then I fill it back up as I'm like I can't see. I'm seeing stars. I'm crying. You know, I'm filling it back up and everything. Slam another one. And slam another shot of whiskey, and I swear I was <laughs> gasping for breath because that whiskey just doubles it. 
<laughs> LBD says shots are nothing. I, I think he's challenging me to a hot sauce off. No, I'm thinking he's talking about alcohol shots. I'm just not a heavy drinker. I don't drink beer. If I do, it's probably going to be, let's see, what's the last beer I was drinking? Probably a Dos Equis with a lime in it. Yeah. Oh. I don't like that IPA shit. I don't either. IPA is a frat boys drink. I can drink more hops than you. Well, why the fuck would you want to? But no, it calls back a Bud Light just the same. Or a Natty Light. But what we really like is the champagne of beers. Michelob? Wait, no. Um, fuck, I <laughs> talk tonight. <laughs> oh, I was going to make something so funny. What is it? It's, um, <laughs> it's MGD, Miller dude. Life. Miller High Life. There you go. Dude, have you ever topped somebody's Miller High Life bottle? That shit does not stop fizzing out. It just... I mean, you'll spill half your beer on the floor before the fizz starts coming out of that bottle. You know what? I may not drink hot sauce tonight, but if somebody buys something from me tonight, I have a bottle of beer that I brewed, bottled, and it's been in my fridge now for like four years. I'll drink it. Ooh. I guarantee you that thing is skunked. Why would you drink that? I don't know. Why not? Wait, I shouldn't have said that shit. Dead Zone just got paid. <laughs> and I don't want to give away another fucking hot boy. Uh, <laughs> Even though yeah, just so you guys know, Dead Zone, the first hot sauce challenge night that we did, Dead Zone bought a hot toy. Mystery box. Or, well, yeah, a but hot toy mystery box. Value over what he paid. Yeah. Then... We do the, the hot sauce thing last night. Dead Zone loves to see me in pain. I think that's all it really is. Oh, I don't think he even cares. I don't think he cares about the hot toy. He was laughing his ass off. Oh, man. And so what's he do? He buys another freaking hot toy just so he could see me cry. <laughs> mm -mm. Mm -mm. So he started it with 50 to make you do a shot. Yeah. Of hot sauce. And then he throws another 50 at it. So I do another shot. And then he throws 100 at it. Which is a shot followed by a shot of whiskey. And Wasn't, then, wasn't then the second started, shot where I got it up my nose? Yeah. Oh, and then he that throws sucks. 150 on it to make it the 350 to do the Iron Man die cast hot toys mystery box. I've got five die cast Iron Man hot toys. Um None of them are shitty. Let's just put it that way. I, I said goodbye to this one gently and softly. I sung to it a little bit. As I said goodbye to it. <laughs> but we got um, about, by the time you would pay to get it off of Sideshow's website, about $448 for 350 shipped. And it cost me $17 to ship his box. Lying about the size and weight to the UPS. If I sell tonight and you really want to pull out Dead Zone, I had the gantry system from like the, the first movie. You can do that floor or you can flip it over and it's the gantry that took his uniform or his uh, suit off him in Iron Man 2 when he was coming into the, um, the show and he steps out of it in a full suit. Um, oh, he didn't pick up his box today. Yeah, I know he didn't. He told us it would be Monday before he could get it. Well, the other one shipped out today. It was actually the first thing I packaged this morning. Um, I wanted to make sure it went out. And then the last thing I did was the two mystery boxes because I had to get all the eBay purchase stuff out. And then I wanted to make sure I gave you all good boxes. So my kids helped me curate these boxes. Um, on one of them, I said, Addison, stop. That's enough. <laughs> and he's like, no, you got to put this one too. And I'm like, all right. <laughs> the gantry system literally ships in a box as big as. I'm trying to see what to compare it to. Well, it's got to be big. I mean, it doesn't even fit in your display case. No joke. The box is two is it's a foot deep. 
It's three feet long, and it's probably three feet tall. It's freaking huge, and it weighs 45 pounds. I would have to send that FedEx. There's no way it would go post office and even be a decent price. Um, but the gantry system is massive, and it's fun. It's Nobody in here got a Pop King Paul box. Yeah, I'm not seeing the comments yet. My comments take a second to come in. Uh, he said, who got a Pop King Paul box today? I wanted one. I really wanted one. But you That's couldn't keep problem. your wallet in your pocket today when you went out. So, well, I mean, we spent a little bit here and a little bit there. And thanks to Dead Zone, we bought a bottle of 15-year scotch. So we upgraded a little bit, bro. Yeah, he sat there. He called me on the phone, and he goes, hey, so I'm looking for a good scotch. What should I get? And he's, like, naming stuff off. I'm like, dude, you're going to have to show me the box. There's a lot of different ones. So we just went live. Uh, kind of not really live, but. Just private message. And, of course, I asked him. I was like, well, what do you like? And he's like, I don't know. I could, dude. I could have been a total douche and told you to get hard pick. <laughs> well, I had somebody tell me to try the the what is it? The three monkeys. The monkey shoulder. Yeah, didn't like it. Yeah, it's a, it's it's entry level. It's very just meh. It was more like eh, like no shit. Ooh, want to trade hot toys for Star Lord and Yondu? What does he have for trade? Star Wars. Because I just so happen to have that one, which is not for sale. And that one, which is also not for sale. Yondu is my most expensive outright purchase of a hot toy. Oh, no, Dead Zone said he got a, uh, a box from Pop King Paw. Oh, you did. If you get the two pack bank robber joker, <laughs> you're going to end up with another hot toy. <laughs> I'll tell you my little testicle to get it. Uh, and that'll ship cheap because it's a small little box. Well, I mean, I don't want like horse balls. Uh, I could have gotten it. Um, I have settings set up on his website where I can ch check out like that. But when I saw it was 450, I was like, well, fuck that. The bank robber joker is only worth like 300 bucks. I don't need all the other shit that's going to come in the box. And it was top row too, which makes me a little bit nervous. Even though he had some good, he just posted a bunch of DC stuff and then a random row up top. Like Winnie the Pooh and a bunch of other things. But um, shout out to anybody out there. If you have the single bank robber joker or the bank robber joker two pack. Jarhead will give you a blow job in exchange for you sending me that pop. What the, it, wow. He will jump on a plane, fly to where you live, go live on Instagram and uh, purchase that pop. <laughs> or I'll, I'll trade over PPG well over PPG to get it because that, that two pack is my two pack grail. I know there's more expensive two packs and I know there's more desirable shit. And I can tell you that I've watched very few Batman movies in my life. And I passed up on buying Joker tonight because I'll buy it on um, what? Probably Amazon and 4k streaming cheaper. Um, but that bank robber Joker two pack, that scene where he gets everybody to kill each other. And he shoots the last guy. And then he takes all the mob's money and fucking sets it on fire. Joe's crazy enough to do shit like that. Oh, whoopty fucking do. Camera probably won't show it. No, this is the Joker knife, dude. This is from Batman. Oh, wait, wrong side. There you go. It's, oh. That's the Joker's knife. It's a movie prop knife. That is the Spyderco M390 in red, which is worth... Quite a bit more than the regular Spider Co's because this is a limited run. And the first one I had, 
the people that delivered furniture from rooms to go back in the day stole it. We know it happened because we had it the morning that the furniture was being delivered and I didn't have it that afternoon when I got home from work. And in moving, we never found it. Hmm. So I got another one. Um, and at one point I was buying those Spyderco PM2s like crazy. I like knives. This is a skiff knife from Lunkers TV and Demolition Ranch. <sighs> yeah, but you took it out of the box and then the box was signed. Not this one. Oh. This is the carry knife. I'm not crazy about this knife. Not only is it bigger and heavier than what I like to carry, because if you're in gym shorts or anything but jeans and a belt, it's going to weigh down your pockets. But it's I don't like liner locks that lock right here. I'll deal with them. I don't prefer them. Probably my favorite action is the Benchmade where you pull the tab back and it, it releases and then it'll lock. Um, Spyderco is a... Um, it locks on the back, which I really like because at no point is your finger inside of that blade as it's coming down. Um, we're going to leave it at that because we're not going to talk about the cuts I've gained on my fingers. <laughs> how I took a box cutter through that thumb and twice now I've had to regrow the fingernail. How do I make that not be so gimpy? You see that scar right there? Yeah. I've lost that fingernail twice and it grows back as this fat piece of fingernail and it's finally kind of back to normal, but you can already feel the ripples. It'll fall off again. You got that white dead spot in the middle right there. That nail will never fully be there again. And it hurts when it starts going to grab it on stuff. Um, so, so far for the list of pops, we have to get signed. We have Deku training. We have hot chick. Deku. <laughs> Momo's not going to be there, dude. No, but she's going to be at somebody else's con in like Dallas or somewhere like that. Yeah. So I'll just get Will or somebody to get their signed and then I'll send them a brand new one. And we can swap and I'll pay them. It's kind of how it works. Um, we have the cards to get signed by Shannon Elizabeth. <laughs> <laughs> Dead zone, you're an asshole, man. But you're oh, that you're that's like messed up. <laughs> well, well I'm not doing hot sauce tonight, so I'm not too worried. So if anybody does need the Avengers Assemble Iron Man, I have two of them that came in excellent condition. I gotta say, well done, Amazon. They are selling right. for $35 to $55 on eBay right now because Amazon's out of stock till February 4th. And with them, I don't know if y'all remember what happened with Iron Man, but they kept pushing back the pre-orders. Yeah. Yeah. Some of them went back like three months. I know it took me an extra month and a half to get mine. I have them in stock. Um, I also have the king of shit back there. If you're a Dragon Ball Z fan, I have the limited run from when Kakarot, Kakarot, whatever the fuck his name is, it's Dragon Ball Z. <laughs> the orange dude, whenever his game released, the special edition pack with the loose pin that goes in his hard case that's inside. Um, I didn't get lucky enough to get Goku. He was the limited release. Um, we got the Water Nook from Frozen, Box Lunch exclusive. I paid nothing for those. Those are really, really cheap. And they look cool, too. The regular one that's just like this blue, milky... Well, not even milky. It's like this just blue plastic. It looks like shit. I saw it today for the first time. Jack Skellington in the fountain, glow in the dark. Um, there's a picture of that on my Instagram of what it looks like at night. I stole that picture. I borrowed that picture, but that's what it looks like. And then we've got Thanos PX previews with the snap. And I have one of that comic book cover left. And then we have all the other ones over there. We managed to go live from my cell phone as a third camera. And we showed off all the stuff over there. Um, we are definitely getting ready for Comic-Con. 
and it's January still. Uh, LBD, I will, bro. Um, you gonna add some other stuff to it, or is it really just gonna be king of shit this time? Nope. Oh. Huh? I got it. Oh, there's a gunshot outside. I just farted. Well, we hey. just we just had a shooting the other day, and I was sitting there laying in bed, and I just hear the pop, 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 and I'm like, "Whoa, those are gunshots!" And then the next day, I hear about somebody getting shot. My grandmother says she worries about me out about me being out here alone at night in my backyard with lights on, but I have this, and I have this. And when these two go together, magic is made. <laughs> Guess that magazine says Dada on it. My, I asked my kid when he was like four years old, when these PMAGs dropped, what he wanted the red nail polish to say. And I only did one side because it took freaking forever. And he said, Dada. And I'm like, done. So this is a legal pistol because this is a supportive brace <laughs> by the hole and the strap make it a brace the atf has classified that um what you use it for and what it's intended for are two different things i think lbd's drinking because he ain't typing in english with the folder well he does come from another country and all my goodness including my own bolt carrier group my own lower my own upper and my own gas block and then a lot of the parts I had designed in collaboration with other folks and my own suppressor that had to sit in jail for nine months. That is a long black dildo. If I've ever seen one. Oh God, don't get started on that. But only a 30 caliber penis would fit in there. He says, Hey, Hey, I was born here. Laugh out loud. Sure. You were. Uh, Nah, LBD is one of our good, good buddies. We love him to death. In fact, he's talking about flying down here to come do Comic Con in good old Alabama with me. I don't know what a Jersey boy is going to think of Alabama, but <laughs> I think not as hick as they make it seem. Oh. You're thinking what else I need? I thought you were saying you needed like a Vegeta at first. All right. I think I've had enough chicken salad. It's good until it's too rich, but I mean, that's all I ate. So that's a couple meals. It's like 10 bucks for this tub of homemade chicken salad where they cook the chicken fresh in the morning. I, when my wife first told me about this restaurant, I'm like, who the fuck wants to go out to eat, to eat chicken salad? Dude, I eat at this place every chance I get. Uh, Dead Zone wants to know if I got anything for sale or trade. <laughs> I'm yeah, all the, all the DBZ crap that freaking Jason sends me. I've only sent you a pop. <laughs> and I threw in an extra pig pen just for the fucking joke of it, asshole. <laughs> Hey, Dead Zone, you weren't in here when I told him. But not only did we tip him for what he did last night, I also sent him my Gemini Collectibles Patina Batman that I paid 30 bucks to get and wanted, but Joe deserved it more than me. And I sent him his two pack. Oh, man. Yeah, pretty much everything that's behind me, that's all keepers. All my other stuff's in my other room. SSGSS. That's the one I think I have on the way. No, I think that's... Isn't that the one you showed Travis the other night? Me? That meta- Yeah, the metallic one. I don't think it's Super Saiyan. And I don't think it's that one. Uh, no, nah, this is this is just the Saiyan Prince, Vegeta. Uh, yeah, you're talking about blue hair, dude. Uh, 
I learned that that just means he has blue hair. Uh, Lisa said she got burned in a trade. That That's sucks. Not. I hate that. I've been burned three times on Facebook. Hey, Lisa, don't feel bad. Uh, one of our other guys, Travis, my cousin, he ended up buying an Arlea v Planet, Arlea Vegeta, whatever, and it was a fake. You're going to send me something or him something? What? Dead Zone said, we'll see what I get in the Pop King Paul box, and I'll send you something from the box. If you get that bank robber Joker two pack, send it to me. That, that way I can screw you. him. Why would you want to screw me, dude? That's like the gayest thing you've said all night tonight. <laughs> that wasn't even an innuendo. That was outright gay. Oh, Mr. Oh, yeah, send it to me. Joe will give you a blowjob. Whatever. <laughs> I made a comment about you. Oh, man. I did find Wyatt Earp today. Um, and I had a chance to get the other dude that everybody wants. Yeah. All I could tell you, Lisa, is if you deal with Jason, you're getting a good deal because he doesn't just send you what he's going to send you. He sends you other stuff too. Not always. I mean, if people outright buy pops, I send them pops they ask for, but I always package absolutely the best I can. I mean, I can't stop the post office from using your package as a football or driving over it with a forklift, but I do everything possible to prevent you getting something damaged. And if you've ever seen any of his Instagram lives, like I opened up one, <laughs> it was jacked up, but I opened it up and everything was in pristine, just condition. It's pop underscore life underscore toys on Instagram. even though that sounds kind of dirty. So I work for the Social Security Administration, and we have our screens we use in our program. And one of them is called the DP screen. <laughs> we're going through that in training, which is for overpayments. But when we're going through that in training, I started cracking up in class, and someone looked at me and said, grow up. And I looked at him and said, fuck you. <laughs> and the teacher looked at me. Uh, I follow you. You follow me. Different name. I got for trade an Ali Target exclusive, a Sarah Connor chase, three merciless Batmans, one going in the J though. No, it's not coming to me. It's going to um, Patrick. And he's sending me the arrow pop I want, and then I'll hook you up on the back end. Did you see that Glock finally made a 22? <laughs> It's Glock. I don't, meh. It's the Glock 44. The hell is that? LBD, the alley DM me. Well, you go follow me and shoot me a DM. I'll follow you back. I try to follow everybody unless you're like not, um, unless you're not a pop channel, I'm typically not going to follow you. Simply because I, when I scroll through my feed, my goal is to catch the new stuff that's dropping. Oh. Yeah, I had all these. Um, I sold all three of them within like an hour of putting them on eBay. I think I put them on too cheap. Hey, we're up to 10. Um. Nobody's bought anything yet tonight, but I kind of feel like doing a giveaway anyways. Yeah. Hold on one second. Uh, it takes them a while to think. I love the mute button on the microphone. No, it's blowing my nose. Um... Yeah, I got too much shit here. All 
All right, here's the way it works on my channel because sometimes I give away a bunch of stuff. Um, Hey, y'all do me a favor, LBD and Lisa. Y'all keep that to like private message because it clogs up the feed and um, it gets people confused of what's going on. Um, if you want to come on and sell something, let me know. And I don't mind you selling it or coming live with me. If you don't act like a dumbass or you're a kid, we've blocked a lot of those on Instagram. But don't do it through the main message. Uh, it's okay. LBD knows better. But I'll give him a pass because he's one of my uh, moderators on my Discord. <laughs> I don't want to piss him off. Um, so the way I do my giveaways, if I do more than one in a night, the first one I cover shipping. After that, I ask you just to cover your shipping. So um, I'm thinking uh, since it's kind of a slow night, we're going to have a little fun. Let's give away a Where's Waldo. As I get up and show my ass as I walk towards the pop wall. In a seven bucks a pop pop shield. Who wants to play? Joe. What? You got an easy way to make a wheel? I don't know. I can't see who's in here. Um, other than reading comments, it's not like Instagram where I can go look and it typically shows me most of who's live. Um, so we can play the game where we ask a question and whatever shows up in my feed first, we go with and we can deal with it. And I can throw in my screen so you can watch the comments roll in my screen. Because I can screen share a, a tab and I can share the comment feed. Um, that's the only way we'll do it because I'm not playing that. Uh, I saw his name come up first because it will show in different order. We are going by what shows on my screen. I've got the admin side of the screen. Mine shows up with a little bit of lag. But if y'all agree to those rules, then we're going to play. Um, all right. We need a fucked up question. Hmm. That'll be something I know the answer to, too. So that's kind of rough. I'm trying to think something off the wall. All right. I got one for you. Hold on. Let me throw in me screenshots. Made the odds. No, it's made the odds be ever in your favor. Come on, dude. If you're going to throw it in there, do it right. All right. So. Let me create a screen share and we're going to share a Chrome tab of StreamYard and that shared like 15 shares, but you can see my feed here. So there is the bottom. It says, good luck, Christina. And this isn't live. So somebody type a comment in Joe type something in and y'all watch it show up. Well, there we go. Christina Payne said, Lisa, you too. So we're in somewhat live. This is how it looks for me. This is what I see. This is what y'all see. All right. So my question is going back to my homeboy, Iron Man. All right. It's a two-part question. I need both answers correct in one comment. In Endgame, what is the name of his daughter and what snack did she ask for when she came downstairs late at night? Or did they have? And don't go to Google, you pricks. That's why I did the snack. Well, I know the snack. I just don't, I don't remember her name. That's good because I don't really remember what the snack was. Because every time I see that playback video where it says, I love you 3000, it makes me want to cry. Well, here you go. I will text you the snack. If you say dick and balls, dude. <laughs> no, sir. 
Oh, yeah, that was it. You didn't text me, you Facebook messaged me. Well, same thing. That's how you that's what you do to people that aren't your friends. There we go. Well, LBD's close. Could we call it a text error and he left off the first two letters? I don't know. I mean, I could be a cheapskate and put the real answer in there. <laughs> I, I think that's that's a close enough answer. I'm going to accept it because now y'all got the answer, basically. He just mistyped because um, it was a juice pop, not an ice pop, but still that's close enough. They went to the freezer. So LBD um, was our winner tonight. All right. We're going to jump out of this weird, like multi cataclysmic screenshot, whatever the hell this is. <laughs> All right. So LBD is our big winner tonight. He gets where's Waldo? And what I love about him is I never knew Waldo had a cane. He's got a cane. He's like, <laughs> some of y'all got to see my cane on live today. <laughs> I don't know why they did the one with him with the cane. Maybe because he's old now. No, I didn't, I didn't get it, Christina. I was just putting down the full answer. Yeah, Jarhead didn't get it. No, it was definitely LBD, but it was Juice Pops and Morgan. So LBD is our winner. Little blue dingling. <clears throat> now, if we want to do another giveaway, we got to sell something and then y'all got to pay your shipping. Wow. <laughs> that is why they wear them tiny little hats. <laughs> you get it now, Joe? <laughs> no, I got it. <laughs> oh, damn. <laughs> but you can't do that. You're a monk. Not yet. Hey, you see my last, my nose and my last name's Friedman. I used to be really stingy with money and then all of a sudden I just like giving shit away. I don't know why. I used to wouldn't give shit away. Like I'd give away $10 off of something. Um, but I enjoy doing it. Um, I don't care if somebody wants to buy a surprise $5 pop. We'll give something else away. I got way too much inventory right now. And I've got some stuff I've had since I opened the business. <laughs> With stickers on it. So, good job, LBD. Yeah, I should start selling hot sauce. <laughs> Dude, we should make our own hot sauce. I dude, I seen a hot sauce. It came up in one of my uh, my little advertisements or whatever as I was scrolling through social media, and it was called "Shit the Bed Hot Sauce." I don't think that should be the name. <laughs> uh, we could call it "Burn When You Pee Hot Sauce." I think I'm dying, hot sauce. <laughs> My tongue fell off. Um, I could be the mascot with the soul patch. Hey, I have to have this, okay? If I shave this off, I, I get carded to go see a rated R movie. I hate it. <laughs> this is freaking hilarious from New York Post. And I tell you, we don't read this shit. It says man received USPS package five years after ordering it. Wow. 
Oh, well, thanks, Christina. I, me and all, what, three of my videos? <laughs> well, maybe she what? subscribed to you on Instagram where we've done a bunch of lives, but they only last for 24 hours. Oh, maybe. Yeah. I, my thing is, is I just, I need to start making videos and I need to set up my studio and soundproof it so you can't hear all the crazy loud neighbors. Um, I don't know that I'll ever do anything but lives anymore. I like communicating with y'all. Um, I don't really want to just sit in front of a camera and talk, which is why I always like having somebody in. I hate it on Instagram when I'm the only one talking and reading people's <laughs> comments. If anybody else wants to come in for a little while, I'll open it up. Does anybody else want to come in with us? Hopefully, like a, Funko who I'm bought it. Travis being in here. He was uh, Joe's fiery butthole. Um, <laughs> I don't know that I would name it that either. Um, and it's almost midnight where you're at. Uh huh. My wife told me good night, which means she's actually just going to bed. Oh. She's not going to text you and go, my feet are cold? No, my feet are freezing. So my toes get so cold, that it feels like they're falling off. And the VA's done all the testing, all the studies. They can't figure out what's going on. So, dude, my feet just hurt. Fuck me. I've lost a bunch of weight, and it still fucking just hurts. Oh, man. I'm reading a guy that tried 10 chicken sandwiches across the country um, to see who wins. And it's the bigger, um, the bigger chains and Chick-fil-A was not the winner, sadly. Uh, yeah. The, the line, it, cause the Chick-fil-A just opened up the other day in my town and the line was like literally half a mile long. It went down the street and around for the drive through. It was ridiculous. So for the next few days, when I go to work, I have to go all the way around. So it's like an extra, like seven minutes to get to work. Of course, Popeye's won. <laughs> But y'all don't have a Jax around y'all. And Jax just came out with the chicken sandwich. You know how you get a chicken breast and when they don't pound it out, it's like this thick on one side of it. It's like Jax serves you the whole chicken breast with the thick side. I mean, you're getting a massive mound of chicken in there. And oh my gosh, it's got seasonings. It's a little bit spicy. Well, not for you. It probably tastes like it needed stuff. <laughs> Oh, man. You know what I miss is Church's Chicken, man. That place. Oh, I still have Church's. I don't eat there. I go to Popeye's and get chicken. They got the pressure boilers. The pressure fryers. Yeah. We got a grocery store that can fry chicken better than most fast food joints. No, oh, man. Everybody's talking about how late it is now. I don't give a fuck. I lived in Virginia. Oh, oh man. Holy crap. Who watches uh, American Ninja Warrior? Have you seen? They got a, a new one. It's kind of like Ninja Warrior, but it's with uh, police canine units. I don't give a shit. Dude, that's awesome. I'm watching Jesse Graff, who, if you don't know who she is, um, she's probably the most talented woman in the world when it comes to running these courses and in amazing shape. She is also the stunt girl for a lot of prominent television shows and movies where it features a blonde. Um, like Supergirl on... Uh, WB or whatever channel it is for you. She's the stunt, stunt woman for that show, which is pretty damn cool. Um, he was at a event for uh, recruiting. And of course there's a Navy tent in the background and she's just showing how many pull-ups she can knock out.
Yeah, she's a woman I wouldn't want to date because she could whoop my ass with probably only lifting a finger. Isn't, you, isn't there a character like that in one of those shows? You, you talking about Deku? Yeah, that's why he's flicking his finger. Yeah. Yeah. I guess I am talking about Deku. <laughs> Yeah, it was funny because in, in the first episodes when he got his powers and everything, every time he would flick his finger, it would break his finger. And he'd have to, he got down to like, he had like two fingers left and everything. And <clears throat> So hold on. They made a general Grievous pop. I've never seen the pop in person, but he's only oh. got two lightsabers. Uh, I think the other ones are like behind him. Oh, it shows in the picture. It was a Walgreens exclusive. So all the boxes were fucked up is what you're telling me. I have a General Grievous minifig Lego figure, and that's about the best I can afford. I do <laughs> want his hot toy, his six scale hot toy. I'd love to have his quarter scale that um, Jetta Patrol has. A giveaway. All we got to do is sell something. Yeah, somebody buys something. I don't care what it is. As long as it's a purchase, then I give something away. You buy, I drink, he drinks, we give away. I think that's in the title. You buy, we drink, I give away. At this point, anything past this, I'll ask you to cover your shipping. If it's a standard size pop, it's $4 to ship. That is less money than it costs me with box protector and shipping label to send you a Ford, uh, first class package. I got to grab a drink. I got one right here. See, I'm sipping it. Good. So if somebody wants a $10 mystery box with a single pop, Let's do a ten dollar mystery box. It's fourteen bucks. Friends and family to my PayPal, and as soon as we confirm that PayPal payment, we give something away. It's that fucking easy. Um, I am gonna need y'all to share this like crazy. Um, we need to get to a thousand on YouTube as quick as we can, so I can go live from my phone. I don't have any idea what it takes for me to go live from anything else from my phone. But when I go live on Instagram, I go live from my phone. It does sit in a gimbal to make it easier for me because I can move around with it. Oh, but crap. Ted's in here. Literally, it's just my phone. When I go live on YouTube, I have a webcam, a light ring behind me, a microphone, and a power strip bank with all kinds of shit in it just to make this shit work. And I spend 25 bucks a month for StreamYard because it's the easiest program to use. But I also need some help from y'all. Um, I have the ability to throw an overlay in like that. I need someone to create me good graphics for the overlay. And go. This is some good stuff right here. That shit is dark. This? Nah. Oh, your glass is just foggy. What'd you do? Steal that from the mess hall? No. It's a... Oh, you probably can't see it. It's a BMW glass. No, I'm drinking Viking's Blood Mead. So that's and like really beer no you know what meat is nope it's honey wine it's fermented honey it's alcoholic and this stuff's 19 percent alcohol that's it for me that's pretty high for graphics and stickers i see a lot of people go to yoga i can do it myself i'm just lazy so I went out, and thanks to y'all from last night, uh, I bought the oldest bottle of scotch I've ever bought. Um, 15 year. 
done in a sherry bourbon oak cask, and it is freaking beautiful. <laughs> I'm glad you liked it. I just licked the bottle for you. <sighs> oh, I've had the 12 before, the green bottle, or that's the 10. But I did not know what it was, and I did not appreciate how charcoaly Jack Daniels can be <laughs> until I tried this, and it's refreshing almost in an alcoholic kind of way. All right. I had that just to kind of. Deadpool, Dead Zone, you started 24 hours ago, bro. Clock reset. Uh, All right. Now. Uh, yeah, I'm not in a hurry. And that yeah. is dark. Tomorrow would be good. Now, I'm probably just going to literally go in like paint and write out Pop Life Toys. And put the logo in there with a big live red symbol above it and be done with it. I can also throw shit scrolling across the bottom of the screen. Uh oh. Dead Zone said check it. Hold on. I I'm creating a ticker. <laughs> We know how he is. He says, check it. That means, well, not tonight. I don't have to drink. <laughs> like that one right there. It's that easy. <laughs> you know, I, I blame Will for that one. Oh. <laughs> You blame Will for that. Why? Mm -hmm. Wasn't he the one that posted something like that on Instagram? Like Joe's going to have a fiery butthole or something like that? I don't know. It was one of those things. He said. <sighs> and now you got to look it up. <laughs> I got to check it. Fuck, I don't know. The, the more y'all spend, the better of a giveaway I do. It says I received $10 from Ted Hargis. But uh, it's 14 to ship, bro. So if you could send that other four over, you will get your $10 mystery box. Sorry, I'm not trying to be a buzzkill or a jackass, but I can't eat that kind of shipping and a small little box. And then we will... Should we do his mystery box on, on the thing, like pick door one, two, or three? Hmm. Or do we want to play some kind of game show like win this pop where you either take what's going or you go for the next round and it could be better. It could be worse. There's a lot of options. I would say we could play some of those games you see, but um, Ted just sent me another 10 bucks. I, I think we're a little drunk and not doing math tonight, but that works. That'll get you. <laughs> $10. All right. So do you want a true? Okay. Done. What is Ted Hargis? Like your other profile dead zone. <laughs> I know that's not your name. I'm betting that's his other profile. <laughs> wow, I got some serious lag on my end. I just... Wait, what? <laughs> go, Ted, go. 
Oh, what is going on? <laughs> I just keep getting money. <laughs> okay, Ted, I don't know who the fuck you are, but dude, <laughs> I got a 10, a 10, and an 8. No, we're not doing hot sauce. Oh, the fuck. Stop, Joe. <laughs> Give your ass a night to recover. 14. Ooh. So you're buying two separate. Well, I didn't know because that's kind of the way dead zone works. So I didn't know if that was his. Stop doing that. All right. Two mystery boxes. Do you want to play a game? Or do you want me just to surprise you with a random damn mystery box? You know what the bad thing is? I can't take a drink of my drink because it's got alcohol in it and it'll burn more. You're the dumbass who put hot sauce on your tongue. Even though yeah, I did. Oh, tonight. Oh, it burns. <laughs> <laughs> yep. It burns. Whew. Uh, I want to lose weight with diarrhea. Oh, man. Oh, man. Yeah, let's play a game. A game of pain. I think he just wants to lose weight with diarrhea. Uh, that's a... uh, what type of game? Y'all give me some ideas. Um, we can play whatever the fuck y'all want to. Um, as long as it doesn't involve uh, shooting drugs or swallowing drugs or any of that stuff. Man. Okay. Um, let's see. First off, Ted, I need to know what lines you collect. First thing, we got to take a drink. Oh, yeah. Oh, man. <laughs> it's going to hurt. Uh, I was told I'm not allowed to pound this. I have to sit this. Oh, man. I pounded that. That hurt. All right. What kind of game are we going to play? House of Pain. <laughs> yeah, Christina Payne said House of Pain. Whew. Um, I can take three pops. Ranging in value. Man. And I can say pick one, two, or three. And you can pick one, two, or three. It's too bad you couldn't set the wheel up with multiples of one, two, or three, one, two, or three, one, two, or three, and it spins, and that decides how many pops he gets. No. No. So what we'll do is I'll take three pops. Um, somewhere like one a uh, under ten, one an over ten, and one a uh, uh, like a fifteen. I don't have Chiefs players. Oh no, Ted's my my submarine guy. I put you a special note in your box. Alex Legends, I think you mean Apex Legends. I saw an Apex Legends pop today. I almost got it for you. Oh man. <sighs> it's NBA Alex Legends, Mandos, and Star Wars. All right, well, what we're going to do is instead of doing two cheap-ass mystery pops, we're going to do a $21 box is what it would be for up to. So it, you, you might get one pop. You might get two pops. You might get three. I don't fucking know. All right, so. Um, and you were the one that told me no anime. So you got to have pitfalls in the game. One of them is going to be an anime pop. I'm just warning you. <laughs> hey Ted, if anything, one thing you can always look at is anime pops are always good for trade. Yes, they are. <sighs> doing a damn good pop for the grail. Whew. 
<laughs> he says he's trying to sell some right now. You got a Silver Age Metallic All Might? <laughs> I have a Silver Age Glow in the Dark All Might. I got one of those too, jackass. <laughs> I'm just tired of waiting on Shoei. With that overseas sticker. Yeah. Not a Barnes and Noble. All right. We have animated, but not anime. Ugh. You know what, Ted? After this, hit me up on Instagram. I'll take a look at what you got. Maybe you might have something I want. All right. So we, we're going to line these pops up on the floor. First, we're going to lay something down because my floor is dirty. And here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to put the, the labels on them, and then I'm going to take a picture of it just in case y'all want to call me a fucking cheater or something. Um, there's one and it's going to go here. While you're doing that, I'm going to link in my IG account real quick. There is two and it's going to go here. I don't know why I'm being so secretive about what's down there. Y'all don't fucking know what's down there. <laughs> Oh, man, that's a fire. And number three. That's another good anime, fairy tale. That's a fire in my belly. All right, so here's how the game works. You pick a number, any number, and we show you what it is. Hold on, let me take the picture just in case y'all jackasses don't believe it. Do I need to put a name and date stamp down there? Uh, zero, zero, two, zero, one, twenty-six. Well, I mean, that's what they want on Facebook. Why the fuck not? This is our own little mystery game done in the most ghetto way we can. Dark rum and hot sauce don't do good to win it together right, either. Door number one. I didn't even say go. Shit. Hyper there a little bit. <laughs> door number one might be Captain Cupcake. Funko Shop exclusive. Add icon as you requested, sir. You can choose to keep him. Put him back. And go for two or three. And, and, and yeah, one of those two. I don't fucking have a third one. <laughs> uh, it's a late night. That's oh, God. Man. He said, who, uh, uh, who, ya? That burns more than hot sauce. It's not who, it's who, ya. That's what name Whatever. Y'all say it wrong, anyways. All right. I don't know what PPG is on this thing. Uh, let's do the old Funko app because I'm tired and I don't feel like actually going to Funko. Or the PPG because I can barcode scan this bitch. I actually sold something on eBay. Seriously? This has been out for how long and it's got insufficient data for trending value? <laughs> Hold on, I'll I'll check it real quick. <laughs> That's funny. What you think I can't do it? I didn't say that. I just know that you're <sighs> well eBay lied, it said I had a notification. All right, Captain Cupcake. Cupcake. Is what they call the captain on a submarine. No, it is not. <laughs> uh, you just call him captain. No matter what there, it is, it's captain. PPG doesn't have Captain Cupcake. 
Did I spell Captain wrong? Let's go to eBay sold. There it is. Yeah, I spelled Captain with an L, not an I. Kaplan? Yeah. Looks like he's selling for about 12 to 14 bucks. So not a bad win on one of your mystery pops. So we're going to get to play the game again. All right, so we're going to pull this out. We're going to make uh, some new switcheroos on numbers. You have won a Captain Cupcake. Now, here's where it gets interesting. We're going to fuck with you this time. Uh, now, realize I'm doing this off the cuff. I have no clue what PPG is. I'm not trying to screw anybody. I promise. It was funny because on uh, Dr. Applesauce's post about, like, you know, crazy ad icons and stuff like that a while back. I yeah. said they should do a Captain Cupcake with little pieces of flocking on them so it looks like somebody dropped them on the floor and he had pieces of lint stuck to him. All right, we're going to move our numbers around. Ugh, they don't care. Now, I will tell you, one of these pops has a PPG somewhere between 25 and 30. It moves quite regularly. Oh, hey, Ted's following me. All right. I sent you a nice little sub message there, brother. Um, I almost sent you my original set of fish, but then I remembered they're packed to my desk at work. Fish? Uh, Talking about dolphins? Yeah. We call her fish. Well. It's an honor to get somebody's first set of fish. Typically, when you have somebody that you're their mentor, um, you pass down your first set of fish to them. It's an it's it's a serious thing. Like we were in a secure shipyard and they let my wife come in the shipyard to watch the ceremony. All right. Do we take door number one, door number two, or door number three? This is for your second mystery box, sir. Door number three. Are you sure? Yeah, I never got an engraved set. My my C dad didn't like me. Yes, we called them C dads. Door number three. We have the Human Torch Hot Topic Exclusive Fantastic Four. Do you Wait want to leave him and go for one or two, or do you want to take him with you? Oh no. <laughs> Go for one. That, that was actually a really good choice, bro. Because door number one happens to be our top grail. The oh. Coca-Cola Bear out of my personal collection. Nice. Congratulations, bro. You just like tripled your money. I was hoping you wouldn't say two because it was the flock Hello Kitty. <laughs> <laughs> I kept true to your request and didn't put anime in there. But I did put an animated character. You have them. Well, that's no good. Do you want to swap them for something? I tried to find you salty from the spastic plastics, which is the um, eagle with the, the shell in his mouth and the sailor outfit on um, for your mystery box, and I couldn't find them. If you want to swap them, I can pull something out. Um... Around that same PPG. Actually, exact same PPG almost. How about this baby right here? Uh, oh. oh. <laughs> I'm going to have to talk with Ted. And the plate of cookies. Why are you going to have to talk with Ted? Because he's got some stuff I want. How do you know? You're looking because I'm looking at his message. What's it say? 
Nothing. It's it's MHA. I don't give a shit. No, it's not. What is it? At Icon? Stop. They're pops. Hey, Ted, send me that same message. I have money. No. Too. Don't. Don't. Joe doesn't have money. I do. So I'm waiting for your response to this. My comment still hasn't come through yet. What do I get for a full eyedropper? You got tears of laughter. Does this mean you have him too? Ah, oh, shit. Um, right, add icon. Let me think. Wait. Is Ted the guy in the group that's always post? Well, not in our group, but in one of the other groups where he's always posting the pictures of all the crazy shirts he has in front of the mirror with a goofy smile. I don't know. I'm thinking. Shut up. I got one you might not have. Okay. He said negative. Well, you got a doppelganger out there. Trying to remember what I sent you in your mystery box. All right, this is one you probably don't have. I have no clue what the value is on it, but I literally haven't listed it because I think it's free and awesome. It is the vinyl two-pack of and Quake. I love this two-pack. And it's like pretty minty fresh. I've had this one for almost a year. And I literally um, have not listed it because I like it. Oh, man. You tell me. If not, I can go back to the drawing board. But uh, we're running out of ad icons that I have out here. Unless you consider the stupid New York pigeons as icons that don't stay in their shells. I like the Cyber Monday bundle. I knew what it was like either before or shortly after I bought it. Don't collect those sadly. All right. We're going to try one more time. And this time you're stuck with it or you're getting anime. You know, us sub guys only have so much patience. For we just say fuck it and walk off the boat. That's when it's dark. That's not when it's the sea. Um, oh, shit. Oh, shit. Remember, I'm only looking at the front of the stack. I have no clue what's behind it. And I don't remember what I sent to you in your box. Do <sighs> you like horror pops, brother? And I didn't say whores, I said horror. He says no. Okay, well, hold on. He says it's worse than anime. I personally agree. What about Disney? Any sports ones? Uh, yes. 
You're going to get a two pack too. It's not a two pack, it's two pops. But you can't complain on this one. It, it, it's the last option. I'm not digging He it. says, or Star Wars. Um, you got Star Wars coming in your box. Let's just leave it at that. <laughs> <coughs> Actually, I do have Star Wars. It's not coming in your box. Friggin' awesome. Hey, and there's Flay. Oh, they're salty. I fucking found them. Ah! Uh, then you know what that means. I'm not sending it to them now. Oh. <laughs> I've got to keep it. It showed itself to me at the right time. You would never want to be doing what I'm doing in prison because the position I'm in, you're, you're right for the pick. <laughs> then down to that bottom shelf. Okay, so this is the only spastic plastic I have never shown for sale. Um, and that's salty. That, and man. it looked like Quentin may be interested in a mystery box, too. Cool. Um, you send money to PayPal. <laughs> so, you said Star Wars. I have Gold Yoda. <laughs> And the only reason I have Gold Yoda is I have one already, so I have a second one for sale. And the nice thing is it's a Walmart and in good condition. Uh, yeah, it's in really good condition, believe it or not. <laughs> Ted's like the first one. Well, yeah, I'll take it. All right, so you got Captain Cupcake. And, and and Yoda, it's your responsibility to go to Instagram and send me a direct message and remind me what you won because it's closer to one o'clock than midnight here. He says, please. So, Quentin, the cheapest box is 14. The most expensive box is however bad you want to fuck me. I mean, you want to spend 600 bucks, you're getting the OG Avengers set. I'm just telling you, because that's all I got that's going to hit there without sending you like 600 pops. Maybe 50 pops. I was getting kind of tiring there. I was pulling good ad icons, and you're like, nope, nope, nope. You know, eh? Ted's really wanting salty. I don't want to give up salty. <laughs> well, I was just thinking if you deducted, say, the, the cost of his win from salty, what would that cost him extra? Huh? If say say you were to deduct the cost of salty or the the cost of his win or his mystery box that he's bought, how much extra would it cost him for salty? I don't know. How much you willing to pay for him? I really don't want to let him go, though. He's just so damn cute. He's got his Dixie cup and everything, even though I don't remember it having blue lines. <laughs> well, let's check real quick. Let me check something out. I don't give a shit what PPG is. I'm just going to be honest. I'm just checking. Don't. I love this dude. That one and the uh, snowman that smokes. How about this? I'll send you five bucks on Ted's app behalf. Why? He just sent five extra. Why? Yeah. Is that all he's worth? It's five bucks? No, no. I'm just saying I'll I'll help cover some of it. How about that? He just sent an extra five. Are you wanting him instead of Yoda? Is that what you're telling me? Yes, they have. Dude, you, have you not followed the fucking spastic plastic line? Holy shit. I got to go digging. <laughs> I think this might have come... 
either in a Christmas box or 12 Days of Christmas a couple of years ago. But they have an elf that's just an asshole, too. But this is flaky. He's a snowman smoking a cigar. He says he's a noob when it comes... Well, he said nub, but I know he meant noob when it comes to Funko Pops. Nope. Nub is what he meant. It means new that, a- that means new underway bitch. I'm not, you know, all up for all these deep semen terms. Keep going, Joe. What? You know, there's some Marines that try to fuck their rifle. There's other Marines that use their rifle to fuck themselves. I'm just saying. Yeah, those, never mind. I'm not even going to go there. <laughs> those are called corpsmen. They're you in the Navy. Me too. Holy shit, I'm confused now. I've been talking to Ted and then Jay jumps in. Dude. Uh-oh, okay. he wants flaky. There's so many fucking hilarious. It's Igor the Elf. Yeah, he's fucking awesome. He's buried somewhere. And then there's like Findu Chomp. I got him in a couple colors. There's Big Al. Um, what are some of the other funny ones I have? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Dead Zone said he sent you a DM. Oh, fuck me. <laughs> it's too late for me to keep up with this shit. Thank God I don't have the hot sauce out tonight, man. Oh, my gosh. He said, did my payment not come through? I wasn't even looking, Dead Zone. Oh, Oh boy. Y'all are going to make me have to ship on Sunday. All right, PayPal. You know you want to load. Dead Zone broke my PayPal again. There we go. Come on. Did you buy the ramen Funko one? No. (laughs) Now, if they'd had a spicy ramen one, I might have bought it. No, I do not see uh, money coming through from you. Dead run. Sorry. It should have been around the same time as Ted. Because that's when he was said, you know, check check it. I got Ted, 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 Ted. Uh, or maybe it was Ted that said check it. But Dead Zone says, I didn't get the Flintstones ones, or do I? No, I didn't. You sent me a DM on IG. If this is a dick pic, dude. I'm, you're dead to me. <laughs> no, no payment in this live has come through. Wow. <sighs> I'm going to need me another salty. (laughs) That's the only only spastic plastic I've ever like said, fuck, I'm going to need another one. Oh man, I made that drink too strong. I did buy two of the Charlie, the tuna fish and sold them for like $35. Yeah. I guess they're going to be making a diamond edition of it. That's fucking stupid. See, my lack of filter came from being on a submarine. Um. (laughs) All right, Dead Zone just sent money. I got it now. So what are we doing here now, guys? I'm confused. What is Dead Zone wanting to do? Probably just make me hurt. Well, you don't have to hurt. 
It's oh, I know. Light. How much did he? How how much did he send you? Fifteen. So okay, cool. Eleven dollar mystery box. So I. <laughs> that means I don't have to worry. Dead if, it, if it was more, I'd have to. I'd, I'd just out of principle, I'd have to. No, don't say that. I don't want to have to send you another something like my Batman because I feel bad. <laughs> what? Uh, Dead Zone, do you want to play a game or just get a mystery? I don't give a shit. Uh. And I have no clue what kind of pops you collect because you've never gotten a pop for me. <laughs> right. And fifteen dollars like, don't buy a hot toy. Joe like Dead Zone. Dead Zone just freaking he pff, He's like, give me a hot toy. What do you mean, what do I want? What do you do, game or giveaway or just random mystery box? I don't know. He said, Joe, what do you want? Joe you wants asking, to throw academia pop. I mean, we know that. No, I, I, I'm I, wondering if he, if he's asking what I want to do hot sauce. It's like, oh, God, don't tell me that. <laughs> no, he's saying, um, do you want to do a game or a random mystery box? I, we don't even know what he collects because he's never technically bought pops from you. We know he collects hot toys now. Well, yeah. Game. Uh, he zone. wants to. He wants to do a game. Okay, I haven't seen that yet. Okay, so do we do the one, two, three again? All right, give me one line you like and one line you absolutely hate because there's got to be a pitfall. Because I do not have any pops. Holy shit. Oh, we got a virgin. Well, he's got hot toys, though. So he's. We got a vinyl virgin, but we got a 1 6 Pro that's just waiting on his dildos to arrive in the mail. <laughs> oh, shit. I want to show you that. <laughs> you uh, me and he ain't gotten the first box yet. You don't have any pops. Oh, shit. We can have some fun. It's like a girl on a cheerleader squad that ain't had sex, man. She popular, but you don't know what she's doing. Well, that cherry's gonna pop eventually. All right, Dead Zone. Um, only hot toys. Did you collect hot toys before you bought the first two from me? Wait a minute. His name is Dead Zone. I'm thinking he needs something horror related. I think we can do that. We can do some old school horror. So, did you collect anything before you came into my life? And if you tell me human skin for lamps, I'm fucking done. <laughs> <laughs> you live in the dead zone. He has long I'm in the life. dead zone. So, you live in Dateland, Arizona? <laughs> That's an actual place, just so you're wondering, Jay. Okay. They have a gas station, a post office, and a place where you can buy dates. That's random. I would laugh my ass off if he said yes. No, he doesn't. He lives in Tucson. Oh, well. Ah, Tucson's not a dead zone. I only know that because I had to ship to his P.O. box. Or Tucson was the very first place I went where they had, like... Automated TV screens for the menu in a McDonald's. All right. Well, Dead Zone. Um, let's play Take Your Virginity. I got to do some thinking here. What, kind of, what do you not like? Like, do you hate anime? Do you like Marvel, DC, Disney, fucking princesses? I don't know. You tell he me. says he'll be seeing Star Wars tomorrow. Take it. Like for the first time? All right. Give me one you absolutely hate. 
Oh, excuse me. Like Joe absolutely hates DBC Dragon Ball Z. Dude, I can't believe it. We've been streaming now for three hours, and we still got nine people watching. <laughs> I got up about... thousand hours and uh, a bunch of viewers. So, all right, so we're gonna uh, fuck. I don't know where to go with this. Um... Oh man. I got to go completely random here. I got to take it easy on this bottle. This stuff's not cheap. Um, Oh, boy. Jay just sent money. I know. He said he was playing after him. No, just the new one. I don't know DBZ, so I guess that. So he doesn't like DBZ. You're right, Dead Zone. You don't like DBZ. It takes some 15 episodes of screaming and yelling and calling each other Kakarot before they throw a punch. It's ridiculous. I don't know what to pick. I'm like stumped here. Pick a Star Wars, a Marvel, and a DBZ. We're going to go a horror. Okay. A Star Wars. Okay. Anime. Okay. But I don't know which side of Star Wars to go to. That's the problem. I mean, Mandalorian pops is what everybody wants. Dude, yeah, those are freaking hot right now. Yeah, hot like Dragon Ball Z. <laughs> All right, we got a three pack. I don't know what price guide is on any of these. I don't think y'all need me to take pictures anymore. Y'all just kind of trust me now. Is yeah, that- B Dog, DBZ is like Star Wars. There are a lot of pops, but the thing is, is both Star Wars and DBZ, there's a huge fan base out there. Yes. So, I mean, even if you want to trade, there's always somebody out there that wants to trade. Now, this is not a swap skis. This is a take it or leave it. And, bro, you won't be disappointed when you get the... the, the... Ted, Baby Yoda is, like, not even out yet. No, I did order a Baby Yoda t-shirt from Hot Topic when I placed the order the other day. Okay, so, Dead Zone. Uh, One, two, or three. Testing, testing. Give it a second. You just said it. (laughs) <laughs> he says three I don't see it yet I see it, it's right there it says three I not shown up yet and it's not baby Yoda Christina it's the I only child. say that because I only say that because it drives people nuts that's like calling a magazine a clip dude oh number three God. It was Janet Weiss from the Rocky Horror Picture Show in her bra and purse and skirt or whatever the fuck that is. Slip. This is a 2015 pop. This came from tbscomics.com. That's how old this shit is. I think her PPG is somewhere in the 20 range. (sighs) Janet what? Janet Weiss W-E-I-S-S I know it was made in China <laughs> Who the fuck is that? I don't know It's from the Rocky Horror Picture Show Yeah Oh Yeah That was That was a pretty good one How much do you worth? 17 Yeah That's above what you paid With shipping So you'll be able to trade it If you don't like it Yeah There's a lot of people out there that That's kind of a little niche type pop right there. All right. So we're going to put three aside. We're going to put dead zone on this one. So mystery box, you typically have no fucking clue who you get. At least, you know, before it gets there. Yeah. I mean, hell, if anything, you can always get on those pop groups and just type in the name of the pop. 
it'll pop up for people looking for it if it's not something you're interested well, in. Well, what I can do is I can take a picture of it with the date handwritten so you can go ahead and post it on social media before it arrives. All right. And pop crack. <laughs> LBD calls it pop crack. Yeah, be careful. All right, we got 14 bucks from Jason. All right. This is going to be our last player of the night. We're going to give one away, and then I'm going to bed. All right. Um, Jay, you told me last night what you liked and didn't like, but I don't fucking remember, so tell me again. Wait, Dead Zone says, will you sign that for me? Sure. The protector only. I write <laughs> funny shit. Hold on. So can I write inappropriate shit on there? Because you should see some of my protectors. <laughs> Give me uh, your Dr. Frankenfooter. Can I write whatever I want? Uh, I think he just wants you to sign it. <laughs> well, you can take uh, uh, rubbing alcohol and take any of this shit off. And then after all this, I still got to jump on Xbox. Why? Because it's almost 11 and I still have friends. So I have shitty handwriting. The Navy taught me that. It says, can you see my nips? And it is signed. <laughs> uh, he says... <laughs> He, <laughs> he says, okay, because I can never get rid of that now since it was my first pop. Well, I only signed the protector, bro. I didn't sign the uh, the actual pop itself. I think it's, I think he means because it's sentimental. Yeah, that's cool. That's Snowman, LOL. Just for that, you're not getting the fucking Snowman. Jay, would it be better if I just gave you the fucking Snowman and called it a day? <laughs> Get this shit over with a little bit quicker. Some people want to go to bed because, you know, they're little babies. All right. Jay pick number one. <laughs> <laughs> we try to make people happy. Jay, do you accept door number one? Sure. Okay. I don't even know how much it's worth. I just always like this dude. My wife doesn't want me to put it in the house because he's smoking. He's got a hand behind his back like he's... Oh, he's got a mallet in his hand behind his back. Fuck, I didn't even know that. Can I sign your protector too, Jay? If you can, you need to put, I love the way you give a snow job. He said, yes, please. He wants a snow job. Now, everybody be quiet. He's trying to focus. It's hard for him to spell. If you really want to mess them up, we count at the same time. Three, eight, the way seven, you 14. Job. Merry fucking Xmas. <laughs> All right. I got one that's signed that I had to hide from my kid. Is that what we're doing for the giveaway? Yes. Why the fuck not? I got to find it, though. <laughs> I think it's right here. Someday. Don't worry, folks. That ain't the first time he said those words. Well, when it's cold outside and you drink <laughs> water, sometimes you have to go searching. Uh, when your balls look like a topographic map. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I got to quit drinking. What happens to raisins? They used to be grapes. Where the fuck is she? She's probably back here. You know what the bad thing about this stuff is? 
this bottle for this mead weighs like freaking five pounds because it's a real clay bottle. Get in there. It's crazy. You know which one I'm looking for, right, Joe? Uh, it's been a while, dude. Yeah, I haven't signed protectors in a long time. My wife got mad at me for signing them. <laughs> uh, when your nuts freeze over, super heavy with sweat icicles. How about swamp ass? He knows what that is. Oh God, a little bit of monkey butt. Yeah. Dude, I was stationed in Yuma, Arizona. You think I don't know what swamp ass is? When you sit on a naga hide seat for six hours and drive a fucking summary. Dude, I, I got stationed in freaking, well, not stationed. I got shipped over to Afghanistan for three and a half months driving a five-ton 23 hours a day. I know what swamp ass is. You can never say you know what swamp ad is, is at 700 feet underwater there, so fuck you. <laughs> okay, I have no clue where this fucking pop is. I thought I did. Yeah, but wouldn't swamp ass at 700 feet underwater be more like trench butt? Um, sure. <laughs> Ah, <laughs> LBD says, yeah, you don't know how hot Honduras is, do you? All right. So our giveaway for the night, keeping up with the theme of the last few wins, is going to be none other than Gil the ugly orange fucking monster himself. <laughs> I think I have him in another color somewhere, too. I think I have him in blue somewhere. But somewhere is a wide open expanse of space. So this is going to be our giveaway tonight. If you want to play in the giveaway, you can answer the question. Remember, you have to PayPal me $4 to cover the shipping. If you think this looks cool, you've been up way too long. <laughs> Actually, Gil does kind of look cool. Dead Zone sent me a message. Oh, oh geez. What are those boxes of, bro? Is that body parts? <laughs> oh, man. I don't know if I want to know what that message was about. I have boxes to open soon. <laughs> Holy crap. How do you let boxes sit that long? Dude, I cut <sighs> them open the moment I get them. No kidding, dude. I got my secret Santa today from Dr. Applesauce Channel, man. I don't think that thing lasted two minutes and I was breaking out the knife. All right. So for Gil, my question also from Endgame. <laughs> Ted says I have been drinking. Also from Endgame. Gotta stick with Endgame. Okay, this is an easy one. Now, uh, let me pull my screen back in. Because remember, it's what I see. And if you fight me on this, you don't get to come play in our lives anymore. Can I just fight you? No, you're in my life. Damn. All right. So y'all can see what I'm reading. Remember, it's $4 to ship if you win. If you don't want it, we just keep it. All right. In the end of the movie, Captain America takes the stones back. What is the very first scene we see after he steps through that portal? And he, of Captain America, not the people on the other side. Y'all can see how long it takes that in a mile in. Really, Jarhead? Because I don't accept that answer. Oh, okay, fine. That's not the full answer. It's not, but 
you know. You could say they have to give her name, too. All right, who's got the right answer for me? The full answer. Uh, they made a fucking TV series about it. Yeah, and somebody guessed it. I haven't seen it yet. That's part of the name with yeah with Peggy Carter. Yes, from the street you see them dancing. So Jay Funko wins again, saves me on some shipping. <laughs> Uh, you only got to send me $3. That's the difference in first class and priority, bro. Actually, no. Nah, I'm going to lie and say it's 15 ounces, so you don't owe me nothing. I didn't tell you that, though. Congrats, Jay. <laughs> send me a DM. Remind me you won this because tomorrow I'm not going to remember. Gonna Man, Lisa's still in here. I haven't seen much of her. Dude, we still got eight people, and we're going three hours and 16 minutes. But we've only got one freaking like. At least that's all it shows there. Uh, I've showed 11. Well, I'm only seeing the one Facebook like. I don't know why. Oh, that that. a, that's a Facebook like. We're talking YouTube here. All right, guys. It has been fun. I'm going to sign off. I'm going to kick Joe out. As he's flipping me off and jerking himself off with hot sauce on his fingers. Y'all pray for him. We're going to finish this nice 15 year scotch. Stay classy. I'll see you tonight. And don't do anything I would do. But remember, do something today to make tomorrow better. And make somebody's life better if you can't make it better for yourself. Um, go to church tomorrow because I won't be there. Later, y'all.